I know. You know? I'm the one who told you that. Whatever. We're live. And you uh, disagreed with me. I don't know if that's true. Yeah, it is. It's Friday and we're working on things. Nicole's here this week and then she's leaving me. I am, unfortunately. Not for good, just for a... Extended period of time. Extended period of time. <laughs> just a couple of weeks, few weeks? Yeah. Three weeks? That was the cheapest flight I could get. Yeah. That's why you're not coming home. Because flights were ridiculous this mm -hmm. year. Mm -hmm. They so, were crazy. Uh, but this week, what I am working on is I've got a Northwest Scale Designs chassis here that was sent to me by Northwest Scale Designs. And I have a poncho kit to use with it. So I'm going to see how much it's going to take to swap this onto that. But this does have like a forward motor mount and transfer case set up. So it's not exactly a simple swap, even though the chassis is set up to have a three gear, you know the deal. But All right. hello everyone. Uh, you check in where you're watching from. Uh, I do have to say thank you to our friends over in Hawaii. Yes. The Batista family. Nicole got a delivery of chocolate this morning. And uh, all, uh, coffee and chocolate and all kinds of stuff. Oh. You didn't look at it? I, I was walking out the door. Lots of snacks. Yeah. So that was awesome. Thank you so much. You guys are wonderful. And Riley specifically. All right, David's from the UK and managed to stay up to watch us. Hey. Just outside our window, T Shock. We haven't seen him in quite a while. <laughs> All right. All right. Sydney, Estonia. Doesn't it already feel like the holidays? <laughs> is it just because you're just leaving me now? It is the holidays. It just feels like it's almost, it's like Christmas already. I mean, like it basically is. Boise. Cats are fighting. God, they're just. They're on one. Yeah. Probably don't need the instructions, huh? Do you want to read those? No, but I think you should so we can get this done. <laughs> oh, my favorite radio comes with this truck. Boise, Idaho. Uh, Phoenix, Bama. You want to play with this? No. Um, worst unboxing. <laughs> oh my god, hey! Squint, Paladores gave us five dollars. I've been painfully reminded that I forgot Bloody Mary supplies. Aww. I have a Bloody Mary right here. In my Scale Crawler Fab Shop tumbler. Missouri. With a pickle in there. That is where I will be, Gary Clark. You're coming tomorrow. Israel, welcome. I do I also have a second cup here of things that was given to me with a very smart ass saying on it from Karina and mine is even better. Uh-huh. All right. Nice. All right. Cheers. Sacramento and Kansas everywhere. We're probably going to try and fit this body back on it when it's done <laughs> for now. Made sure. So to say, I'm watching on the big screen, typing on my phone. <laughs> Nicole's always Indiana does not like the sound idea of her on a big screen. No plane tonight. No plane tonight. I didn't want to make you so riled up right before you left. <laughs> <laughs> we had a discussion about this in the mod chat. We're like, should we do the plane tonight? I was like, just make good Nicole good and fired up, and. Phoenix was like, maybe you don't do that right before she leaves. I was like, hmm. It seems like it'd be a better idea to do it right <laughs> before I leave. <laughs> Let you cool off. Yeah, but like. So when you walk back in the house and see all of the planes that I've all of a sudden accumulated. That will be an issue. <laughs> um, JLC said, Josh, I took your advice this evening, dug a really deep hole close to 10 feet, then filled it back in. Oh, yes. 
Finally, that is exactly after what I would do. All the live streams because I miss them being new to the channel. Thank you, Josh and Nicole. You're doing a great job, Nicholas from Quebec. Hey, reviewing all of them. Wow, that's a lot of work. Yeah. Um. What are you giggling Indiana about? Indiana Spartan, thank you. Welcome. Um, there's just, everybody is here. It's a popular night. I guess it's getting to that winter time, so everyone's... Winter's coming? Yeah, everyone. We're starting to hunker down. We're getting to build season. <laughs> Scale Nats time. Matt yeah. and I are excited. Yeah. We've got trucks to build. Um... Jesse says, well, this is trash. I'm sorry. <laughs> Johnny Davis just picked up a second VS410 Pro. Thank you, Robbie. This is um, from Josh's packing manager. Yes. Work wife. Yes. I say that in all with all love and thankfulness that she's there because I don't know what I would do without her. So... <laughs> 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 yeah, at least two months of reviewing, including the two build series. I'm hoping. <laughs> well, thanks for joining a live stream then. Yeah. Seems like. Let's see. And I did hear that, Ben, that Nancy's coming to scale Nats, so I was excited about that. Yes. Uh, Moose just said also that I believe he is going to bring his wife. Oh, good. They're going to spend some time in Nashville. And everyone should do that at some yeah, point. Nicole's favorite place. It is. Um, Scott Oblander, thank you for the five dollars. Josh picked up a oh, set of cool. ten three straight axles. What should I build with them? Oh. I mean, there's so many opportunities. Um, build a. I mean, my class two's got ten three straight axles currently. So. Dale sent you a picture on Instagram, tried to make you jealous, had 13 yards of gravel delivered, dug a 70 foot ditch for a new drainage system and dug a French drain next to the house, all with an excavator. I am jealous. Excavating. Nice. Randall got a ham and a $600 Christmas bonus. <laughs> yes. Reptor rides on twos, patiently. Reptar. Reptar. Patiently I, waiting for my Phoenix in the mail. Was super excited when y'all got them back in stock. Couldn't help but order one. There you go. There wasn't a large amount that hit the website, but there was some. There you go. So the rest of them will be in right at the the beginning of January. So right now, for anybody keeping score, I am disassembling the truck, taking the axles off at the moment. Uh, just disconnected all the links, disconnected the shocks. Drive shafts. Um, 949 Design said we got our 10 bags of satisfied jerky into the employee stocking. So mysteriously, mine disappeared. That happens with all of mine. Crawl Center wants to know if anyone in West Phoenix wants to get out tomorrow. Um, well, that's awesome. Yes. About the jerky. And I doubt that I will get any when I get back. <laughs> Gunner, thank you for the five dollars. Speaking of, <laughs> Nicole, I'll get you your Christmas jerky after you get back. We know a certain someone will <laughs> eat it. Also, one more week for live stream takeover fifteen twenty one, and that is fifteen percent off. Oh, fifteen percent off is satisfied jerky. There you go. Dale got some worm again today, and him and his son are about to die. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I had some Armageddon last week. While you were not here. Oh, is that when you were hiccuping? Yes. I, was I got the absolute, well, you were at the house, but you were not in the stream. Uh oh. But, oh my God, it it just hit me funny. Like, I, I just got, not a funny, I guess it just hit me hard. I took a way bigger piece than I normally would. Dumb. And it just whacked me. Just got here, what are we building? We are taking an SCX-10-2 honcho. Bone stock, I just pulled it out of the box. And I'm swapping on a Northwest Scale Designs scattergun chassis. I don't remember exactly like what V this is, V version something or something. Um, and then it's got the forward motor mount system in it. So it requires a transfer case. And for that, I've got the T-1 
TGH transfer case in this. We'll get all to that soon because we're going to start bolting it back together. Nicholas Roslin gave us $35. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Nicholas, no question. Just a No, I know. Thank you. That was so funny. Oh. How much of this truck will be left at the end? Um, I'm going to try and reuse as much as possible. Like I'm going to try and do a, a swap. Like you bought a chassis and you bought and you had a truck. It's the thought. So we'll see how much of it. I'd like to maintain as much as we can tonight. That's like my goal. I'm already annoyed with your voice. My, hmm. That's a new one. I know. You haven't told me that before. I know. I'm just like, oh, Is there something God. about my voice? No, just listening to you. <laughs> something about your face. I really want to punch it. Anything I can do about that? Nah, it's just something about your face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, all I can do is just take that in and work on that. <laughs> I'll miss you. <laughs> yeah, who, um, like, I know we don't have any CEOs of freaking airplane company, airlines here, but if we <laughs> did, like, can you make tickets not so expensive so they were gonna my be husband like a can come home with me? They were going to, the problem was that flights were going to be like $800 or $900 each way for me this year. And because Nicole goes back, she can be pretty flexible. For right. Me, okay. For me, I would have had to go back like basically right after her to make it reasonable. And I can't just, I can't be gone that long. Yeah, especially after this year. Uh, Merry Christmas to you both. Thank you, Rusty Sills. Currently watching this from the pool, sipping on sangria. Exactly how I plan on spending the rest of the holidays. Um, Where are you? Yeah, I'm, I'm jealous. I know. I'm about to use my Kung Fu Raw Builder Kit to build a BCB3 with a TGH2 low trans and a revolver. What is good gearing to start with, Josh? Um, I can't remember what that TGH trans has internal gearing. Um, I have to actually finalize that for the G speed with that same transmission I have here, but I haven't done the math. So I, I wish I could tell you better. Um, RC mass masters here. Are you still mad at him for buying all the class one RC tires? I don't know what that means or probably. <laughs> 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 oh, he's in Melbourne. Ah. Um. Hear me? We'll come back to the rest of the <laughs> electronics shortly. Let's get this thing. What's your go-to receiver? I use Fataba radios. So the receivers that I like the most are the 2106 GF, uh, which is actually an airplane receiver, but it works great for uh, surface-based as well. So... Um, yeah, that's my go-to. Our friend Eric Baker is here. Josh, how would you set up the dig to an overdrive servos on a Futaba 4 p.m. for a Phoenix? Um, Eric, I've got a video on programming the uh, 4 p.m., I believe, on uh, when I had the VFD dig video, and I go through, like, exact programming on that. And I would do it the exact same for the Phoenix. But like, if you want actual step-by-step, -step, look up my VFD Hertz dig video. And I've got like really specific info that will save you time. Um, love the banter between both of you. There's a tie between Josh and Matt and the both of you. I mean, what? no one can make fun of you like your wife. <laughs> Then why can't I run a VFD at Axial Fest? I believe that they are What's having an internal conversation. Oh, VFD is not a DLC. Axial yes, transmission. you guys should come for sure. You have to run an Axial style transmission. So you can run an upgraded one, but it has to be Axial style, which a VFD is not. Will the 210, no wait, 2106 GF receiver work with a Futaba 4 p.m. transmitter? Yes, yes it will. All right, Dylan, we're happy you're here. Um, Mark Cargill, thank you for the $5. Gotta love the scatter gun. It's an amazing chassis. Corwin is a great dude. Ah, I, this will be my first experience with it. So I've worked with Corwin before. On, Jesse uh, Schultz, you would never say that. What would he never say? Are you sure? 
Getting a bomber for Christmas. What's the best first upgrade? Um, oh, I mean, trailing arms are a good one, but I also did a whole budget build series on that. It's worth the watch because that will, I have like 20 some odd weeks of upgrades in like about the order that I would suggest. Oh, there did you, you stick your tongue like, oh. Tw yeah, 20 some videos, like, ew. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, thank you. <laughs> Click on the links below, subscribe and <laughs> fucking notifications. I don't know. Um, Josh, I have a TRX4 tracks and I want to cut the windows to look like they are rolled down halfway. Do you have any advice on how to do it? Um, That's a good question. Put masking tape on the window towards the top and trace the line and then peel it off and move it down and then cut along that traced line. That way it'll keep the same shape, but just be down. That's how I would do it. I've never done it though. So way, way your... Yeah, I would say it if she wasn't around and at work. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I need tires and foam for my Bronco TRX with brass, not as much brass, but would like Josh to help with info, please. Thanks, Eric. Hmm. Uh, I would go, depending on, I don't know how much brass is, the amount of brass you're talking about, but I run Crawler Innovations Foam, um, and you can run medium or firm, you know, if you're starting to get up there in like the nine pound range or something crazy. Okay, I apologize, I skipped through some questions. Um, Eric Baker gave us $5, thank you. Thank you, sir. Just got my body from RC Patina, guys. So now time to finish the build. Oh, hey. Nice. I want to see that. Hello from Charleston. Hello. I wasn't that artful Dodgers chassis, but I don't also don't have a great place to run one. This is Alex. I have an SX24 on order. Your budget build series was great for information. Um, Hopefully it helps. How do you install a Vanquish radiator in a VS410 chassis kit? Um... So the radiator was meant for the, the pro body initially. Um, other than that, you're just going to kind of have to come up with a place that you want it and then make a spot for it because there's not like just a drop in area beyond that. So it's kind of an up to you thing there. So the stock axial pivot balls are too wide for this 3D printed skid plate. So I'm popping the plastic ones out and replacing them with some metal ones that I have around. I like that Frank Slugga actually put my name on here. Like I would know even what this truck is or what it does. Um, but that was kind of you. What do you think if, of the low C Nightcrawler? Any good upgrades for this rig? Um, so that was a truck that I was never like a huge fan of in the past. Uh, just the, the worm gear setup that it had. It's been around for a really, really long time. Um, and the, the problem is- Did you your opinion? The, well, the reason I'm saying is the reason the popularity of he did say I think no. what's your opinion on it? No, he didn't. Didn't he? No, he said any good upgrades for this rig. Well, my bad. But the problem is that it's getting to be a really old truck, and uh, the upgrades that used to be available are becoming very hard. I've seen a lot of people like try and search for the parts, but you're gonna have a hard time finding stuff anymore. Josh, is this a flat rail chassis? Or are you feeling okay? It is. <laughs> Have you done much with your budget build SCX24? I've not done anything with it since the series, honestly. What chassis rails did you choose? They look like a great low center of gravity. Uh, this is called the Scatter Gun, but I'm not sure which version it is. It's the SCX version, but I and maybe I'd have to look at the website to be exactly sure. Well, thank you, WV Defender, for being here um what would be the best first upgrade for an scx 10 2 um did an scx 10 2 budget build as well with the honcho and there will be that series you can check for exactly what my whole links are a great spot to start but that was like that was matt and i both did it together that was one of our first series that we collaborated on it's like 16 weeks of videos times two people. So 32 videos. That's a lot. It is. I would suggest starting there. 
Hi, Sucky. Is a bit is the bit is there a big difference in final gear ratio between the VFD and Axial three gear trans? Uh, final gear ratio? No, there's not a huge difference. Oh hi. Oh hi. Hi, Suck. Um, is underdrive and rear and overdrive in the VFD overkill for class one? No. It's a V2 or possibly a V3. The C1 didn't have a hollowed out rear section to improve front weight bias. I figured, I, I think that it's the most recent because he didn't send it to me very long ago. And at the time I was just like, I'm not sure exactly when I'll be able to get to this, but I'll do my best. RC Patina guy, thank you for the $2. Merry Christmas. Here's my last dollar after Christmas shopping. Well, thank you, sir. Good to see you. Yes. Yeah, as soon as I found out Josh wasn't coming home, I... Um, yeah, she did some extra shopping. For Emmett. Like, you're not coming. I, I mean, we were going to spend some money on flights, so... Emmett needs more. My mom was like, you have some wrapping to do when you get here because I have everything sent to her house. And I, she was <laughs> like, you, better, you have to get on that right away as soon as you get here because it's going to take you forever. I'm like, woman, you're the professional wrapper. Like, I don't... Drow, like start start getting on it <laughs> hey josh cj here i live in tennessee them ar4 like i already said that before i said them ar44 axles like you are working on they're safe for 2-2 uh no i would not suggest them for 2-2 you i mean you could but it's it's not a not a great axle choice for a 2-2 um, the gutless belly dragger says, would you ever do a budget build up where you had to fabricate the majority of parts for the real nerds? I mean, I would be all for it. Matt's not as much of a fabricator. That's... Frank Slugger, those, them are fine words and no, um, the Chiefs should not have lost last night because... <laughs> Both teams should have lost last night. That was a garbage game. No. I don't even watch football very often. And I'm like, that game was garbage. It was just that we were equally matched with the Chargers. You guys were equally shit. Giving away... Not equally shit because we won. Yeah, that's true. So On a lucky to coin toss in the OT. It's not my fault that the NFL's OT rules are stupid. Yeah, that's true. <sighs> When we've had the studio tour, when do we get to see the rest of the house? Um, never. Uh, I did do some major cleanup in here, though, after my embarrassment last week. That's what I needed. You did? I did. Really? Look at that. There's a path. You the, can get to the desk. See? That is what we call progress. Um, no, I mean, our house is super tiny, and it's not that exciting. I know. It's Very, definitely not that exciting. No, so. <sighs> I didn't know last night was a toilet bowl. It wasn't. Who does a better job at wrapping presents, me or Josh? I Who's don't... me? No, me or you. Oh, okay. I don't know that I've ever. Have you ever seen me wrap a gift? No. Then you would be hard pressed to know the skill level. Oh, I did need to I did not look up how that kit was that got knocked oh, yeah. out because that was rough. That I don't care what team you play for. That did not have that was that was so scary. I'm and I really hope he's okay. Dangerously low on nuts. Have you seen my nuts? <gasps> really? What performance upgrade would you recommend for a TRX for sport originally a 79 blazer? I feel like you guys are gonna get sick of hearing this, but guess what? Matt and I also did a TRX4 budget build. <laughs> but you can go watch 16 weeks of video of both of our opinion on what to upgrade first. Um, you need to get the center of gravity lower on that. Try not to add all of the brass in the world because that is going to hurt you. We do you still have the engine block table. We do. I do. In the garage. Um, I need to get it cleaned up and probably sell it. How do you mount that body on the chassis? We're going to figure out a way here tonight, I believe. I reckon. Let's see. Josh should just admit at this point he's a portal guy. Portal axle guy. So where did you stash the stuff you cleaned up? The garage? 
Um, yeah, a mix of different situations. Do you still practice karate? Taekwondo, you mean? <laughs> Do I still practice karate is what I call it? Um, my wife is watching for the first time. Can you show her the TRX 4000 battery? <laughs> You want to, will you grab that truck? Yeah, it was Adam really bad. The red, it's the red one. The red truck. Yeah. This one? Yep. Oh, move that one on top first. There you go. Jesus. Oh my God. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> I, this is you haven't picked this one up before, have you? No, that was that's stupid. I feel like I just got a workout. I don't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> that's the only reason I really had you do it. <laughs> yeah, I was set up. So <laughs> here is the truck, and that is the battery. That is stupid. It is. It is the size of a com like a. It's bigger than a brick you would use to build a house. That is what you come up with? What would you call it? I mean, probably not that. Why? It's the shape of a brick. It's very heavy. Yeah, there will be no yeeting of this Bronco. <laughs> <laughs> no kicking. <laughs> um... Yeah. <laughs> oh. Bigger than a Honda battery. There you go. Hot? I am. The size of a car radio. Car radio? That's... People don't know what car radios are like. That's... Most people have yeah, never seen... Yeah, the anti-eat truck. <laughs> Bigger than the battery in the RS. Is your Gladiator stock? It is. Other than a stereo system in it. It makes loud noises. Only have to charge once in a lifetime. Yeah. <laughs> Josh worked up a sweat picking up that truck. <laughs> it was cold earlier. It was cold. Yeah, it was. In the shade all day. Din or double din? D uh, <laughs> the radio in the old Jeep is a double din. The radio in my new Jeep is stock, but the... At, I've got uh, subs and an amp in it, and they're very loud. I would have turned bright red if I said that <laughs> out loud to people, other people. I would have like, <laughs> I would have been so embarrassed if I said that I had su subs in my car. <laughs> <laughs> you like it? He does have a bed cover. Uh mm huh. -hmm. You should do a heavy conversion on SCX six. It's such a bad idea. I did it just to be ironic. I don't want people to think that I think that it's a good idea. Why you your shirt out there? Why would you not just put it on the back of your chair like a normal human? Because you don't have to pick up your clothes off the floor? That's true. Oh, I have to change the Panhard link. Well, that's new information. Josh, NY Gangsta? My mug says, my husband thinks he's famous. And his says... I'm not saying, what does it say? I'm not saying I'm famous, but I am a pretty, a pretty big, big deal. Oh. I'm a pretty big deal. 16 year old me loved my 10 inch bazooka too. Oh yeah. I had a single 12 in my Jeep when I was 16. Like, now, now I have, I have. I, when I asked him, I'm like, who, who, like, yeah, when we were all 16, Back in the, what, early 2000s? 90s. You, not me, <laughs> early 2000s. Everybody had subs and it was like a thing. But now I'm like, who is it? who's the market for subwoofer boxes? Josh was like, we are. Yeah, people our age who now have people the money. People in their 30s who have money. <laughs> so... Yeah, now I have 
The and the subs I have now are six and Adam a half put, inch. The only subs in my truck are from Subway. <laughs> I have two little six and, and now a half he, inch, but they're like thirty pounds each, and I have fifteen hundred watts. And now, hot gauge. And now he is it. cognizant of. Uh, I, I turn it down before I get in the neighborhood because you don't want to be that guy, the guy with two jeeps in the driveway who's bumping the whole way down the street, waking <laughs> up the kids from their naps. It's good and loud. I like to turn it up in traffic when I'm, Nicole's with me. Cause she's like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Am I? Yes, you are. Because Speci I'm a no, because it's giving me a migraine now because I'm like embarrassed. I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> and the custom car scene there still, but yeah, that's who a lot of um, Gately built for. I help a, I help a guy who's a uh, manufacturer for- Hashtag bumping. Bumping. Ma a manufacturer for subwoofer enclosures and uh okay a lot of people are talking about how they're bumping as well see we are still, still a base head we're still cool we're we're as cool now as we were then <laughs> uh alex had two 10 inch subs in his taurus when he was 16. Just say you had a Taurus show. Like, no one will check. I just say it. Just, like, get some extra cred and then... Yeah, like... Like, I don't know if you know... Ev you know what everyone... Everyone's just like, yeah, it's a Taurus show. Do you know the motor's made by Yamaha? Like... <laughs> it was, like, wasn't it the fastest production car at the time? Uh -huh. No. 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 That was something Taurus show people would say. For sure. I'm not saying Taurus shows weren't cool, but... They were not as cool as people who drove tour shows thought that they were. I mean, I never, I was like, mm, that's still a Ford. Cool. You did not come from a Ford family, huh? Well, you drove a probe. Yeah, that had a sensor in it that cost like $600 that only Ford had and it did nothing. Mass airflow sensor. Uh, map sensor, yeah. And it would die at every stoplight that I stopped at. And it was Barbie pink. So. But not that isn't the color that you would have preferred. I mean, yeah, obviously. I mean, now I would want that. Now you would want that, yeah. Actually, no, probably not. Yeah, I obviously know that. Oh, look, see, my first show had a, but he said S-H-O. He did dots in between to oh, correct me. Oh, oh, oh. Had a Yamaha engine. They all had Yamaha engines. I'm just saying that that was something that... Every... Oh, Alex did have a show. <laughs> Those plastic links should go to Sands as Baller. They should, you're right, but... As Baller, Ryan, are you coming to Scale Nats? Yeah, are you coming to Scale Nats, right? He is, for sure. Was Brian, Ryan, were you at, you were at Nationals that year, weren't you? I had, no, he was not. He wasn't at No, now? it was, that was called Blues Up. I had subs about 10 years ago, now a few months ago, but sub in my Voyager and it's amazing. Don't hear the kids screaming. <laughs> <laughs> I think it would help. I think it would help put kids to sleep, right? I Seems like a good idea. Like just the small vibrations of their soft heads would help like soothe them. Um, Hashtag parenting. Yeah, don't take parenting advice from you. Um, yes, Josh does play with his RC trucks. I do. And more than I would. <laughs> oh, Nisa says, apparently I'm too old. My sub sat on my shoulder attached to tape deck powered by 12D batteries. <laughs> <laughs> Michael says I'm 60 and have subs in my truck so what now what yes that is awesome my internet friends are cool see? I don't care what you says, say I got custom bluetooth sound systems in his RC see I've seen that as well I'm annoyed by that because I'm like you can't fully hear what songs are playing from far away and it's just like obnoxious. I've been around some that were loud enough where you could. If you could hear it, like if it's loud enough, then I'm fine with that. Like go for it. Play all the music you want. Except for our 
demographic is usually like fucking death metal or something. And I'm like, mm, <laughs> Nicole's not a death can metal. We not? <laughs> can we not? <laughs> Um, because he's gonna be like, Yeah, I do play death metal on it. <laughs> Anyone else looking forward to seeing Josh Crash playing? I am. You are? Um, Gunner's wakeboard boat. Gunner has a wakeboard boat. Hey Gunner, did you know that I water skied for the University of Kansas? So deuces to this dumbass all summer. <laughs> Let me know. Is Gunner married? No. Damn, I gotta get him a Woman, so I can have a friend. <laughs> I, don't, I mean, I don't know that he's trying to become married, but you know, maybe he smartened up with age. Raven Stale says my wife is available. <laughs> Hey, Nikki seems like a nice lady. I, I, I agree like, with her. On, on. I agree with her on many things. Not uh, that one. <laughs> uh, Ravensdale's idea of a burrito is stupid, and Nikki and I agree. Yeah. <laughs> Frank's Frank's ex is available. <laughs> I mean, if if I if, I, if Gunner's jerky sucked, I'd introduce him to my ex. <laughs> He, <laughs> I think he's too stable for that. <laughs> um, oh, you use loud music to drown out the kids. I use the smell the rag method. So <laughs> Jesse, <laughs> how can burritos be stupid? His idea of what <laughs> differentiates a burrito from a taco was dumb. Best regards from Germany. Hello, and for you. And to you. Sean. Das is... No. Good. No, I saved you. Okay. Um, what is your opinion of the Vantera K10? Um, Vantera is a dead platform, says Arthur. That is the problem. It is Sean a... S., thank you for the $5. Happy holidays, guys. Josh, I bought Incision Light Kit and the Q-Series headlights. Can I swap out the headlights with no issues? Um, Like, if you just don't plug them in... I, I don't... I think that the... Q series, you can't plug the Q series into that light set. I don't think. I feel like they would. Yeah, I don't know. I've not tried it. You could try it, but I'm not guaranteeing that the light set will. The Q series should be fine. I just don't know that the board will be okay. Vegan burrito can be stupid, says Perry G. He agrees with you. Ooh, um, would the ESC receiver in the SCX24 be able to handle the Holmes 380 revolver? Um, no, because that's a brushless ESC, and the ESC that comes in the car is brushed only. So you will have to change it. Um, good call, Andrew. I should do that. Have you signed off up to volunteer at a soup kitchen near Roosevelt Road on Christmas? Hmm. Do you guys have the 6x6 RC car? Um, I do have one, but it's been modified to go fast. Who else bought, bumps Tom McDonald? I don't even know who that is. Tom McDonald? I don't, I don't know who that is either. Is he the one who, oh wait, I bumped Major Tom. Not even the right Major Tom. Stop. Don't, don't say that. Raymond E. Tanner, thank you. Happy holidays from Valley Falls, New York. I don't want to talk about it. What, about what? About your stupid songs that you download one at a time on fucking apple music it, and then it mine comes. is better one at a time is better you downloaded the whole shitty paula abdul album so i have to skip through 15 of the worst songs i've ever heard from the 90s garbage music it Who sounds like the mayonnaise kid that dropped bad the live commercials show back in the day josh kicked oh my him but God. everyone i watch your live events i think of that so Back, this was before, this was back when I used to do the, called Live Hangouts. Oh, where right. people could just my basement, yeah. Yeah, your basement, yeah. my basement. Uh, Our basement. Where people could just join in on video. Oh, I remember that. And this kid joins in and he's like just sitting there like not saying anything. And he just like starts putting mayonnaise. That's amazing. On his face. You kicked him out? It was so no, weird. You kicked him out. It was so weird. Yeah, he just got there and just mayonnaise that's incredible oh like, you're so you're the worst 
you're the worst. I would have been had his fucking life story, where he lived, like what he like. I would have had everything. You, how have you not been kidnapped? <sighs> no one would kidnap me. They'd be like, "Oh, go back to where you came from." <laughs> no <way. laughs> Why did you keep coming here? <laughs> like, that, <laughs> wait, how did I not know this? This is amazing. Yeah. No, you just like Miss Lippy and Billy Madison putting the glue on her face. Yeah, just. <laughs> That's amazing. Right. I will have somebody on the live stream if they do that. <laughs> 100%. Okay. So I've got this to a roller, but we need to put a we need to make a shaft that goes from the Ford motor mount to the transfer case, and I need to swap the motor over and the ESC and the servo. I'd kidnap Nicole, but I don't like me being made fun of. So yeah, you wouldn't. <laughs> so you would not kidnap me. You'd be like, uh, you <laughs> you need to go back where you. How are you married? Be like, so where's your parents from? <laughs> How many siblings do you have? Like, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Having issues with my pan hard and my SCX tan too. Which adjustable links would you recommend? Um, I mean, I run the incision ones, but it's because they're the ones that I designed. Thank you very much, Miss Libby. <laughs> that was the that was on what the other night, Billy Madison. Mm -hmm. That movie was terrible, like the worst. I forgot how shit that was. Like I still like Billy. Okay, so I still bad. like Happy Happy like, Gilmore. Everyone likes Billy Matt. Like no, Happy yeah. Gilmore, quality film. Billy no, Madison, Billy, garbage. No, it's not. Like, it's funny. Like, how many times, like, in my head, do you know how many times a week in my head I'm like, nudie magazine day, nudie magazine day. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> Jake and I used to, at work, we used to go, like, what day is it, Nick? October? <laughs> it's still a garbage movie. Stop staring at me, Swan. Stop staring at me, Swan. Shampoo yeah. is better. <laughs> Conditioner is better. It leaves your hair silky and smooth. See? It's a good movie. No, it's... Pee in your pants is cool. Wait, wasn't that... That was... No, it is. Big Daddy. No, no. What? Yeah, that was no, Big Daddy. No. No, it's not. Really? I never... <laughs> Nicole has a sense of humor of a 15-year-old boy from the 90s. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> so why... Uh, I think they're funny. God, they're just, I just. Yeah. I think your pants is cool, considering me Miles Davis. Oh, oh that was the bus driver? That's The right. bus driver was Chris Farley. Yeah. 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 See, now they're all. I'm just, all what? They're gonna. Are they gonna really try and defend? They are that garbage movie. <laughs> yeah, everyone is. Everyone. Everyone, really, everyone. Um. Yeah. Rock and steady says I still have packs of screw kits from y'all. Hey, Nicole counted those screws. Mm-hmm. Somehow I convinced myself that it was free labor. <laughs> My son and I got a 3D printer for Christmas because of Josh. Hey, Thank hey. you. It's so much fun. I'm happy that you're happy. I think I should bring back STL Sunday for like a couple a week. Um while you're gone. Can you run a stock SCX102 transmission on that frame? Yes, you could without the forward motor mount. I made Nikki watch Kingpin. She said it sucked. Tell her how wrong she is. Okay. Kingpin is a better movie than Billy Madison. I can't I don't even know Kingpin. Um, we made, I made him 3D print his mom a bunch of 
card holders for her Friday night card game. They play Shanghai. Yeah. Which, was which is, we played it as well. I liked it. I actually didn't mind it either. No. It is not a quick game, but I actually did like it. Toe Daddy, was it one of those talking movies? Yes, it was. It was one of them, was one of them moving pictures. <laughs> um, but it was very full. I feel like there's a cat in here under something. There always is. Huh. Holmes. Oh. What? John Rob's here. Mr. Holmes. Hi. I miss you. I still have screw sets too. Josh's most expensive screw counter yet. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> we never get to see John Rob anymore. My favorite. All I know is a... <laughs> what? Hey, Josh, is there any way what? to do three-way switches on the 4 p.m.? See yes. everyone saying hi to John. Uh, three-way switch, you program it to 100 steps. So <laughs> it's uh, just go to your uh, like trim dial menu, select the switch you want like DT2, and change the value to 100, and that will be a three position. DLC, thank you for the $5. <laughs> he said, I know, I now have the hiccups, and Jesse keeps saying no, 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 and gives you the middle finger. <laughs> Son just threw up. Good thing I have two more bags. John says, I've been falling asleep at 8 p.m. Central lately. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Yeah, everyone likes Johnny. Wears side eye shirts and makes cool motors. Oh, we're dropping frames, but that's okay. We're back. He's like an electric Bob Ross. <laughs> Bob Rocks. His his. Oh my uh, gosh, that was so funny. I showed Nicole that video when he came out with it. I was like, what a dork. Um, Brian, thank you for the two dollars. How about prepping for Scale Nats Sunday? We're gonna have to do something like that. This motor mount is gonna take a much smaller pinion. Oh goodness, it's actually YouTube, not us, that is doing it. Oh, really? Yeah. Hello there, children. Is Emmons racing? So. We should be back to good. We're gonna swap this pinion off for now, go to something smaller, because I need a motor that doesn't have a bearing supported end belt. Jesus. Need some purple low pros in your VS4. Prime time says refresh, folks. Cream is good for me. Let's see if this will break it. We have not been to Columbia, Missouri for quite a while, if you think about it. No, it's been a ridiculous. Oh, shit. Look at that. I twisted that whole thing around. Wow. You're so strong. So strong. You're so strong. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay. Well, we're going to have to heat that up because I twisted an L wrench around. The hell amount of Loctite that they use on this stupid motor. John is here. We're just going to abandon that. We're going to grab a Holmes motor. Let's see. Um, let's see. Nope. Wrong box. Hold, please. Sorry. Okay. So Trailmaster 21 turn, Trailmaster 55 turn. Crawlmaster 20 turn. That's. Oh, are we done? No. Here's my chair. Oh. Crawlmaster 12 turn. So we're going to go with that one because that's around like a 27 turn. 
Okay. Please read while I put back. Mm -hmm. I have a TRX-4 and running a hobby wing axe to motor and ESC. Any ideas on what I'll need to upgrade before I break it to find out? Um, I mean, the TRX-4s are really durable. You're not going to break a ton. So, uh, you know, the durability-wise, not a whole lot of concern. Pull out the spreadsheet. <laughs> it's an app. I'll, I'll adjust it on the app in a little bit. What's up, buddy? That's spicy. You don't want that. So we're going to throw the 550 motor on. I'm going to grab a pinion. Nobody can see. Let's see what this pinion will do. It's a 13 tooth. I, um... Would you say the Armageddon would be comparable pain to putting Ice Cat on the boys downstairs? The son has the jerky stuck in his braces. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, very. It's a very different. It's a wildly different pain, really. Aww, Randall says the two wild kitties we have been feeding. His mom is named Yellow Tabby Butter, and the Siamese Tabby Bonnie Blue Eyes. <laughs> Okay, let's see. The cat on my 90 inch TV. <laughs> Will you eat more Armageddon tonight? No. What would be a co good Maybe. Co could comp chassis for a TRX4? Um, Brazen Scale has a TRX4 specific ATL chassis, which would do the job. Supposed to get snow on Sunday. Going to be lift or bomber weather. Um, that's Chief, and then the other one's Sookie, and they are Cheetos. They are half Bengal and half Ossicat. Let's see. I now I want to put a scatter gun chassis in the TRX four. At work with John McClain again and just tuning in. How's it going? <laughs> That's funny. Can we start sending you hot foods to eat live? No. No, you cannot. Do you think Phoenix kits will be available next month? Uh, yeah, beginning of January, they'll be available. Tony, long day dealing with pg &E. I'm just here for Nicole's defense. <laughs> I don't think I need defense. <laughs> <but> <laughs> and uh, help you take care of my man while I'm gone. Half bangle, half Aussie cat, which is just a regular cat. Putting the new Bronco body on my... Gun on my wraith. Gunner says eat it, pussy. For two dollars. With two dollars. Thank you, Gunner. I'm waiting to see the pickle action. I'm waiting to send I'm sending you that to sour candy to eat live. I love sour. Oh god, she does. Mm -hmm. I don't know why she likes sour so much. I don't I don't know. Okay, well, serious question. What tier foam do you choose for certain events? What tier? Um, I run I run a pretty consistent foam choice. I run uh, mediums in the rear and soft in the front usually because my trucks are usually around um, five to seven pounds. Will we get a release date or should I just bang my F5 starting December 31st? <laughs> I don't know what that means. I don't. F5 is the refresh button on a keyboard. Really? Yeah. Huh. But... Uh, I don't give exact dates. I'm just going to tell you the beginning of January sometime. What is your opinion of the Atlas 6x6? Six six? Uh, I never owned one. I don't really know much about that brand. Is Vanquish going to come out with aluminum axles and separate upgrades for the Phoenix? Uh, you'll see upgrades from us for the Phoenix, yes. 
Do you think an SCX 10-3 would compete well in a class one? SCX 10-3? Probably not. Oh, Perry's getting lots of snow. I forget he's up farther. Yes, he is. I'm abandoning this motor for the moment. I'm going to have to play with it. Hit it's... the like. Thank you, Gussie Banjos. Well, she does like you, Mr. Sour. Psh. Fieldman's Excuse in Blue Springs has sour cherry candy. I don't make it to Blue Springs all that often. Blue Springs? Blue Springs, Missouri. It's the only one I know of. It's the only one I know of. Is as there well. a Fieldman's? I'm assuming he's saying that because we're from Kansas City. What's this? You're assuming. Shouldn't always assume. I love warheads. It's had warheads for. I love war. I remember unwrapping them and giving them like to my aunt, who's the sweetest person on the planet. Like legit. Mary Sue. Yeah, and being like, "Oh, here, try this new candy we got." Like, can you imagine doing that to Mary Sue? No, like she's the, I mean, the like last the person in the world you should ever play a prank no, on. Because she's like the night, the sweetest, just like, like the most she's genuinely like sweet person, an angel on earth, and we fucked with her as children. We're like Mary. We're Sue. like Nicole's mom. It, you you can. Do that to all the time because she would do it to you the earliest convenience at so, any point. So I've grown up um, traumatized. Well, with every plastic animal you could ever imagine snakes, spiders, um, uh, roaches, uh, tarantula in my bed next to me. I was terrified of E.T. when I was a kid, so she bought an E.T. stuffed doll and put it in my closet. With the... Do you know that at Vanquish, at by our the computer where we all write our purchase orders, okay. is that rubber snake that your mom hid in our closet when she left? Oh, yeah, like she did. Like three years ago? No, that was like oh, more than that. Or four, yeah. Four because years. I went to take down a suitcase and a snake fell on me. Yeah. And I was like, like months after she left. Oh my god! Because she thinks that that stuff is funny, or like tying a rubber band around the sprayer on the <laughs> kitchen faucet, so that when you turn on the faucet, it sprays you in the face. Um, okay. Good night, Jim Rob. Hopefully, we get to see you soon. Um, shark fatter, see customs. Agreed. I still don't like to see BT. Would you have a live, a live the crew from work? Live the crew from work? Um, she's not. She's a terrorist, Adam. <laughs> you talking about your mom? Yeah. Jesus. She is. <laughs> she lost her phone. She had to go buy a new one today because she left it on top of Justice's car. And I, I mean, I always ask you how in the world you do these things. I'm like, how did you, how do you lose your phone every day? But now I get it. Yeah, but she had to go buy a new one. I never have to buy new ones. It's because you don't go places you would leave things. I don't leave things on top of my car. Rob Montana, thank you for the $20. Hi, guys. Happy holidays. What's Happy holidays Rob? to you. E.T. was a three-foot walking turd with an endoscope. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, it was definitely not a, an attractive prop. No, oh. terrified, nightmares my whole life. I, I still don't. I remember one time she bought, they had like E.T. cookies and she bought them and put them in my lunch. <laughs> like. I mean, you were a picky kid, I think. Sorry. No. I mean, it seems, I don't know how you ended up like that as an adult. Picky? <laughs> About what? <laughs> <laughs> About what? Bing. Bing bong. <laughs> what? What do you want to tell Joe Biden right now? <laughs> From TikTok. Uh oh. Bing bong. <laughs> That's not a question for the chat, oh, everybody. Oh, God. Why would I don't want to hear it. Yeah. I know. I mean, obviously. That's a cool miter box. Where did you get it? Amazon. Ugh. It is a just a cheapy, but I don't want to fire up the Dremel right now. So he is just not. 
I'm not. Yes, I love Flight of the Navigator. What? I love Flight of the Navigator. I don't remember that one. I know you don't because we talk about this literally once a week. Flight of the Navigator comes up once a week yes. in our house. The sh the There's one with no the, way. the ball that he's in the spaceship and he does this and he yeah we talk about it once a fucking week, Josh. That you never that you don't remember Flight of the Navigator. We talk about this shit all the time. I don't think I don't ever remember talking about Flight of the Navigator. We. You know what I'm talking about. The I one where we talk about the, the thing that comes up that he, like, the spaceship and he, like, does, has, like, the ball that he moves it around. We talk about this all the time. <laughs> I don't think, are you screwing with me? No. Hmm. I don't believe you. 300 second time out for Josh. Thank you, Jesse. <laughs> He does frustrate me so bad because we do talk about this all the time because he, like, I love Flight of Navigator and he he's always like, which one is that? I'm like, where he ends up, like, with, or the eye comes down from the thing and it, it's like on a, like on a thing and it, like, talks to him and he, like. Sounds like a hokey movie. Seriously? It's a great movie. That's what you get. Gunner, thank you for the two dollars. Twenty percent off until midnight. <laughs> Funny Nicole, twenty percent off. Twenty <laughs> off. Uh, satisfied jerky. <laughs> this is why she is sick of your voice, Josh. <laughs> <sighs> Bro, <Bruh. laughs> thank you. Exactly. Be like. Oh, P.B. Herman was the voice of the ship. Didn't know that, but I did watch a lot of um, P.B. Herman growing up. We're about to see Josh stabbed with a five millimeter driver. <laughs> Jeremiah Salberg, thank you for the five dollars. I don't like it when mommy and daddy fight. So <laughs> I'm working on my son's SCX10 Deadbolt. It's running the same motor you're putting in that rig. Hey, hey. Yeah, chrome ship that changes shape as well, and he has a bunch of creatures on the ship. Ever seen it? Where can you get that frame? Um, I linked it in the description of this particular video. Entertainment, you Is are watching. Is that how you do it? Click the link below. Is that how you do it? <laughs> They're doing a new one. One was literally named I. Okay, that was the... The one that looked like an eye? Oh, now I, I remember it. Now... <laughs> I don't know. Doesn't sound like a great movie to me. Wait, Scott Quick just blew my mind. It's a kid playing a video game. Would Vanquish think about doing sweaters or hoodies? They should. Yes. Nicole, if you do anything Actually, to Josh, recently. delete this video and we never saw anything. <laughs> <laughs> Josh's cause of death. Gaslighting. I also don't know what that means. I'll explain it to you later. Josh, you know Flight of the Navigator? It was a show where the guy flew to Earth in an egg, aged backwards, and said nan in it. Oh! No! No! I don't know why I read all... that. I don't know why I read that. I've that seen that. That was Mork and Mindy. Yeah. Not Flight of the Navigator. Is it the same thing? No. <laughs> if Nicole snaps, these videos will be used as her defense to clear her of murder. <laughs> Temporary insanity plea. If people visit the 2022 scale national next year, are tickets required for guests? No. Nope. Or just the people who brought their rigs for the event? I heard Nicole was going with you from live stream takeover. I am, but, and I don't buy tickets to any event ever because I, you'll never see me drive a car in it. No, if you wanted to just go, it's only for people who are like competing in the event. Did which you ticket? the soundtrack to fly the What? He's kidding. Oh, oh, really? As I say, I watch Business it. Business idea. Sell landmines as prayer maps. Oh. What? Oh. oh my god, I did not mean to read that. We can go ahead and Um yeah, I uh tickets sold out for scale nationals in like seven minutes. Wow. What are good B block wheels to use on Gatekeeper using RC four wheel drive tires? And I'm sorry that I read that. I did not mean to, and we accept everyone and <laughs> no matter what they <laughs> they're Beliefs um, or anything would be. 
I mean, really, beadlocks are kind of subjective. Obviously, I use Vanquish beadlocks. I'm just about everything for a reason, because that's where I work. Um, but they're also the ones I like the best. But, you know, find the style you like. Um, oh, Ian says the kid from Flight of the Navigator robbed a bank in 2016. Oh, <laughs> see, your idols are terrible people. I'm, I'm just not one of my idols. I you just, said you love it. You talk about him like every week. Movie. You talk about him every 20 minutes, you said. Brian trolled you today. I, what? I don't know. Brian says he trolled you today. I don't know. So they were sold out? What were sold? Yeah, the tickets? Yeah. For Scale Nationals, yeah. To actually compete? Class 1, 2, and 3 sold out in minutes. But you can still come to Gadsden, Alabama. You can still come and just hang out and have fun. The and there's tons of crawling around there. Like, and places to hang out, and it's a bl fucking blast. Don't worry about tickets. Yeah, like, you could just go and get some of the best rock to crawl on. Like, it's a, an amazing time. So It's so much fun. If you didn't get tickets, you can still come, and you'll have as good a time as anybody. Especially if you've never competed before and you don't want the stress. Like, I mean, but those courses there, I feel like are stressful. They, that's what I'm saying. If no, you but like the, they're like, I remember watching a whole group of people hook up to rock, like to actually crawl on rocks physically. Oh yeah. And they jump over the edge. And I was like, I'm done. I, I have a, I have a hard time with, I don't like heights. So they, uh, to clarify, these weren't RC people. <laughs> no, they were like. It's there's an actual very obviously RC people are never physically climbing on rocks. We are? Uh not with your hand no. Psh. You haven't been to an event in a while. Hey. My favorite part of Fly of the Navigator was when he was flying around blasting rains down in Africa. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of, have you seen the video to Toto in a while? Um can't Toto Africa? Never. You haven't? You need to watch it. It is problematic. <laughs> if it, same video would not be made today. <laughs> Just, what the? Cut that down. Awesome deal on the free methods when you buy an Ultra, by the way. Oh, yeah. Uh, if you buy a VS410 Ultra right now through the end of the year, since yeah, the Phoenix exactly. is out of stock. Don't want to damage your comp hands by crawling. <laughs> Uh, if you buy an Ultra through the end of the year, then uh, you get a free set of Method 105s. If you buy of any color. Oh, fantastic. If you buy a Satisfied Jerky and use Funny Nicole 20 off, you get 20% off. It's <laughs> the first time anyone's called you funny. It is. I know. That's why I was like, you're kind of a joke. <laughs> Because I'm not. Just ordered some Armageddon jerky to feed my son. He's 24 and can beat me up. <laughs> Careful there, Toad Daddy. You're going to be on live PD. If that were still a thing. He's in that area. He's, what do he's you mean? He's in Missouri. Oh, he's in the area where live PD was yeah. filmed. Okay. <laughs> I was just like, what do you mean he's in that area? <laughs> and why not the pro, says Brian? Uh, just because the Cause Ultra it... has portals and so does the Phoenix. So it's kind of sometimes the same customer. <laughs> Michael, thank you. Nicole, I need to win from the Chiefs last night. Yes, we did need it. And yes, Travis Gilmore says, what if we already have the Ultra? We haven't uh, seen then, Travis in a while. Then you could have two. And you a free set of wheels with the second one. <laughs> could you run TRX4 axles on an SCX-10 too? Don't know. Um, I'm going to buy my... Dad, the SCX24 Hot Racing Front Steering Links for Christmas. Any thoughts? Uh, I think that those have been fine. Buying your dad Christmas gifts. Old Time RC, thank you for the $5. Hey, hey. Thank you for the vacuum former video, but I think people will buy the Phoenix before they will buy a vacuum. <laughs> What's the website for the jerkies? Um, Gunner, could you put in satisfied? It's spelled S. You can, you can spell satisfied jerky just like it sounds, or you can spell it um, like... S-A-T-I-S-F-I-D. I have the Armageddon in a separate bag, just in case the cat was to get on here and lick a bag or something. Oh, everyone's saying there's a Flight of the Navigator documentary called Life After the Navigator. It includes robbing banks, I'm sure. Um, I see what you did there. What? Very clever? I don't know. You guys, these chorizo breakfast tacos are so good. Yeah, who... 
what do you what else would you use what what that's what i use in all of your breakfast burritos that i used to make you chorizo yeah really yes i didn't think i liked chorizo you do i've specifically told karina that you like chorizo hmm. potatoes and chorizo and egg and cheese and yeah, you like trees, though. Bruce Gibbs, good evening, everyone from Alberta. Adam says, eat some, eat some, eat some. <laughs> did you see that Fairtech is going to release a one-tenth combo soon, motor and ESC? I did not see that, actually. Nikki Fisher, which we hope you're doing <laughs> well and recovering well. Wait, Nikki Fisher didn't have a surgery. Yeah, she did. Or, no, I think you're thinking of... Ravensdale, right? Yeah. She had a surgery, too? Nikki? Yeah. But I thought it was... Uh, Angelina, Rivera. Thought Angelina oh, Rivera. I thought Angelina Rivera. Right. I'm sorry, Nikki. Yeah. You didn't. Angela. I hope. Angel. Angelina Rivera. Angelina. She said. <laughs> she's a, no, but she, she's going to be like, no, what did he say she, happened? She says, I bet those breakfast burritos don't have lettuce. <laughs> Chris <laughs> Caruso had. Yeah, she is Ravensdale's wife. Thank you. I That's know that, I but you were thinking. Oh, happy holidays, guys. I'm getting hungry. All this food talk. Slip some Armageddon in this next burrito. Nikki had surgery. Yeah. She did? I, yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Why did she have surgery? <laughs> Why is everyone having surgery? I, I thought she did. <laughs> what would you use for a motor? Either the Tekken Rock 412 3100 KV or Castle Slate 2280 KV for crawling and why? Wow, I cannot believe after a bottle of You got I all of that, that done. I know. Congratulations. Uh, I like the uh, Rock 412 best. I don't, uh, the Castle motors I find to be a little underpowered for their size as far as torque goes. I love Castle ESCs, not a big fan of their motors. I like the Holmes motors or the uh, Tekken motors. I had my carpal tunnel fix in both hands from all that RC card build support for Ravensdale. See? See? Carpal tunnel. See? That's a big deal. It is. That's a big surgery. That's a big deal. Um, Frank Slugga, I kind of am going to barf from what you just said. Just made a peanut butter and sauerkraut. The f what? Toast sandwich. Oh. That peanut butter and toast? There's sauerkraut and toast? Peanut butter, sauerkraut, and toast. What's the price on that frame? I, uh, I linked to it in the description below. I did not buy this frame. This frame was sent to me, um, so I do not know. Um, Alex says, carpal tunnel is a constant worry in my field. Yeah, everyone do their exercises. Does that really help? Yeah. Can a Castle ESC and Holmes motor make a combo? Uh, yeah, you can buy them both through Holmes. And you can call it whatever kind of combo you'd like. Okay. So, we got our... I think that I want sushi. Is that a real thing that you're saying out loud right now? Yeah. I picked up dinner specifically. Oh, yeah, you I... did. Damn it. But I'm like, I'm thinking about it. Like, I'm not going to have sushi the whole time I'm back home. Because no one will I mean, eat I'll it. eat sushi. One time my grandpa said, I had that sushi stuff you love. It was wrapped up in a crate at the IHOP. I was like, that is not sushi, Grandpa. But good try. Just because it's wrapped in a cylinder does not mean that it is sushi. But good try. That was a crate. God damn it. I made the intermediate shaft between the front motor mount and the transfer case. But I did it with the motor mount in the lowest position where it won't clear. And I made it too short now when I raise it up. Son of a bitch. With enough time and proper amount of curse words, a VS410 battery tray will fit on an SCX10 deadbolt. Alex says, I want sushi now. Tekken RX4 with a 3100 HD motor will not start smooth unless drag brake is turned off. Any ideas? Gunner um, had sushi. I have a... F uh, if you go to the last video in my bomber, my, my bomber rebuild, which was like a year ago or something like that, I go through all of my settings of the RX-4 with specifically the Hertz that I use for, uh, you know, like frequency settings, the direct, and it absolutely will start up fine. You just have to go through there, check my settings, and that should get you um, a really good setup. Gary Clark, the best place for sushi in KC is up by next door to Rancho Grande in Parkville. Yeah, honestly, best place we had sushi. Better than anything out here. No. Yes. You are. You're insane. It's because you remember Casey Sushi first. And because I. 
love Casey. Yeah, and now you're talking... You're talking about Hill can, Hill People Sushi in their Kansas. Their sushi is better than any sushi I've had out here. It was good sushi in Kansas City. Better than anything I've had out here. You're crazy. Okay, I'm ordering sushi. Fine. And then we're uh, done? No. When it gets you? No. What? It is 7.15. It'll take an hour at least. Well... I doubt that very much, but... Uh, it took two hours to get pizza last night. It is true. That's true. Uh, would you recommend Tekken or Holmes Motor for the Phoenix? Uh, I've got one of each. Um, just kind of a personal preference. I've got a Holmes 2700 KV and a Tekken 3100 KV. I personally like the 2700 a little bit more. Um, but I don't think the Tekken comes with a 2700, so... So, yeah. There you go. Um, I'm going to have to remake one of these two ends, but that's okay. More importantly, I'm going to take this motor mount out anyway, because I need to get this motor pinion situation figured out. And I'm sick of doing it in the chassis. You can take the girl out of Kansas, but you can never take Kansas out of the girl. That's freaking right. Like trailer park sushi your trailer park <laughs> your your what your trailer park <laughs> oh dylan Donan donan says Min Son moonlight of... sushi and liberty is pretty solid I we used to do I... moonlight too that was uh, right by the chipotle Right there by uh, Target. Liberty. I used to go there quite a bit. Can you use the Sidewinder Micro 2 for a one-tenth crawler? <sighs> Sidewinder. Um, I never have. I've used the Mamba Micro, but honestly, I would highly recommend just buying a one-tenth scale ESC. Like, it's better than farting around with the other ones. All right. How much... God damn wiggle room do I need to make here? It doesn't seem like a whole hell of a lot. We're going to do a little bit of filing to make this work. I'm going to need you to convert words on the screen to audio. Because my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Old time RC says jerky discount does not work. It's because Nicole's not funny. That's the joke. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> oh, these are expensive. I'm going to have to wait. Yeah. God damn it. I'm hungry. I don't want chicken. <laughs> I specifically asked you, what do you that want That dumb guy. Kansas is nothing but trailer parks. Been through there. You've never been through Kansas City. <laughs> that that is true. You won't find many of them in the Kansas City area. No, not none, but not many. Right. <laughs> that old time RC. I'm going to copy and paste it for you. Oh, I don't know where our keyboard is. It's by my feet. You good work. Thanks. See if this is more. Cool is the bet you won't hit him, girl. <laughs> what does that mean? Like, when someone says, I bet you won't hit him. No. Like, like you want to bet? <laughs> I have a Mamba X. Would the Bomber ESC setting work in your bid? Um, no, the Mamba's programming oh. is different than what? We're spinning. Uh, it's fine. It's still fine up there. Unless YouTube is just being funny, but I think I YouTube's being funny. Yeah. Jimmy Two Horses, thank you for the five dollars. Five dollars for a bigger pickle. He does have a pickle in there. I do. Thank you, Jimothy. Did you just say thank you, Jimothy? Jimothy. The formal. What do you think of the new Proline 24 scale cliffhanger body? I think it's rad. I like the cliffhanger and uh I like the the small one too. 
Trash raise your eyebrows if you're in trouble. Oh, yeah. Oh, I have too much Botox to raise my eyebrows. <laughs> yeah. My no move. <laughs> <You're t> <laughs> you sound very extra. <laughs> For my migraines. <laughs> Look, I, it's been a few months. Has it? It's been two months. That's as much as I can move them. <laughs> <laughs> is the Phoenix that you get free methods work? What? No, the Ultra is where you get the free methods, not the Phoenix. Um, who just said that? Alex, Botox for migraines. Yes, that it really relaxes all of the muscles in your head. But trust and believe I would get it if I didn't have migraines because it works amazing. <laughs> You're extra. It is. It's incredible. I had a big line on my forehead and it has gone now. Do I have a smaller pinion? What is this? 13. Everyone put migraines in quotes. No, like for real. <laughs> for real. As a new resident oh, aeronautics expert, what ARF would you recommend, Josh? <laughs> ARF is almost ready to fly. Oh. Um, you know, <gasps> the Turbo Timber is a good starter plane. Otherwise, I'd go right to the Draco. Old time RC. Thank you. I'm glad it worked. Um, JK R J King RC. I almost got my ear pierced last time you suggested something for migraines. Okay. The Botox is the best thing ever. For real. That and the Nurtec, and I still am looking for somebody who knows how to I know do that piercing. I know a girl who knows how to do piercings. Who? Uh, uh, Mandar, little Mandar. But that one, the, oh. ask her. She knows how to do the specific one right here. I mean, I don't well, want like I think piercing. It's I don't weird. want like a bunch of piercings in my face, but I just want the one right here. It's like right here. Look, it's like right there. The mm. dude to do it. It's supposed to help. Nicole just wants to look nice for Josh, even though he looks like Josh. <laughs> Alex. Crawler Baller, thank you for the $5. Since you hate 24 scale so much, tell me your Betty build. Sure. <laughs> I don't hate it. I just haven't touched it since. Okay. We're going to do a little bit more carving over here. Um, Nicole coming to Alabama in April. Hashtag passport option. <laughs> she'll be there i won't because i love alabama she'll bring her coloring book i have lots of coloring books you do have coloring books <laughs> for when we do long car rides no i can't do i can't do anything in the she does full tongue out coloring all right but not in the car because i can't <laughs> do things in the car um I'm so sorry we do not speak any Spanish. I do a little bit. Parabens Puelos' videos? Yes. See. Si. You don't know. I don't. Shh. It will be in Gadsden. It's near Gadsden. Hell, you will fit right in here in Alabama. Yeah, I know. I love it there. Oh, we've been there. We've been to this site. Done been there. More than once. Don't get. Y'all come down here. <laughs> like, it's my favorite. Um, I remember trying to find Nicole. She just disappeared for like a few hours. And I was like, I have no idea where she went. And she was just like in somebody else's tent. And they were like making hot dogs for her. I don't remember that. I do remember you being like, someone coming up to me like, hey, your wife is over there flying kites. And you're like, oh, yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right. That's right. Yeah, that was the other thing. I'm like, where's Nicole? Like, I think I saw her over there flying a kite. Like, Because who? It was Sue from RCP. From RCP. who Sue and her husband are Dave, yeah. amazing. My favorite people ever. And she... <laughs> she brought kites. She fucking brought kites. And, <laughs> and Nicole's just like... And she was like, do you want to fly a kite? I was like... Yes. What? <laughs> um, yeah, of course I want to <laughs> fly a kite. Are you joking? She, they are, they are 
hands down some of my favorite people on the planet they're the nicest most genuine <laughs> fabulous people from rcp yeah is that what they are rcp is? crawlers rcp crawlers they are some of the best <laughs> humans you will ever meet in your life aren't are they not yeah. <laughs> they're i mean i look forward to seeing them at any event they're at they're fantastic um <laughs> Can you just imagine Nicole sitting there flying kites? We were standing, but yeah. <laughs> Sue and I were flying a kite, and all the kids were like, where's my kite? I'm like, get the fuck away yeah, from back me. Back off, kid. It's your kite. It's my time to shine. My kite. Um, Jeremiah Salvick, thank you for the $5. Did you know with enough time and proper amount of curse words, a VS410 battery try will fit in an <laughs> SCX10? Are you related? Are you both related to Sergeant Dan? <laughs> No, it was not a hobby kite. Stop trying to take my shit. Like, just be normal and go get a fucking kite from Walmart. And... I think it was a nice kite. No, it was a Walmart kite. Are you was... sure? Yes. You didn't have to have a license for it or anything? Heather Thomas, thank you. I have both pierced for migraines. Well worth it. Okay. What did they call, what did they call Dath. it? Dath piercing? Yeah. Done. Thank you for saying that. And I will try and remember that. I will ask. And are. I feel like I don't like. Oh, what? Nothing. Um. Where? I need a shorter screen. I'm assuming Frank. That anytime I go to the dollar sign meaning hobby store, I buy a kite. Have a nice collection. <laughs> <laughs> Niw is that a thing? Or it's just now? He meant to say now. Yeah. Yeah. If someone asks you if you want to buy a kite, you can't say no. I was excited. This is amazing. Nicole it was a would blast. Fly. If someone said, "You want to see my puppies in this van?" Nicole would run to like, "Which van am I going to?" J King, try the Nurtech. It's really awesome. The Heather Thomas. Do we know Heather Thomas? Um, we do now. Heck with RC, and I'm gonna go fly a kite. God damn it! I need another four millimeter screw. Sure that the sound is real ASL. The ASC crawl is going to be at Bear River this year. I'll bring your kites, says Perry G. <laughs> RC Mouse Master. Happy holidays, brother. Um, Brian, thank you for the $2. I know I trolled you, but what body for class one? Um, so it's really all about how competitive, you know, like how competitive you want to be. If you're not super worried about that, then um but you know, it's like you want is one that's as narrow as small as possible, but fits the rules basically. That's the big thing. Arthur Eastridge says, "Don't tell me a white van with free lipos wouldn't draw you in." I mean, I can hold my own. <laughs> like, <laughs> are kites allowed at Axial Fest? Ugh, probably not. It's in California. <laughs> Good night, Kevin Venturino. Dude, it's puppies. <laughs> Dude, it's puppies. <laughs> I'm not there yet. We gotta do some more filing. Okay, free RC planes. <laughs> <laughs> Would you build another mud truck? I mean, I always build random mud trucks here and there, but never am I like, I don't know, it's always like in a moment of weakness. Okay, whoever Heather Thomas is, somebody, Voodoo Trucking had a Heather Thomas poster. Is it Dave's daughter? That was Wendy, stupid. Oh, Wendy was his daughter? Yeah. She's the overshadowed daughter. No, she's... Her, she had round, side. she had round burgers. She, and the other one was no, like, Wendy, no. Wendy was Wendy's. You sure that was his daughter? <laughs> just saying uh, possibility people can have more than one kid Nicole yeah but Wendy was uh... dude this is a Wendy's was Wendy's Wendy was Wendy's was Dave Thomas's daughter <laughs> I think that's a fictional story you think so I don't think Dave Thomas really had any daughters 
The Phoenix body is banned in 27 states for being too loud. <laughs> Says Alec. <laughs> Fall Guy, I don't remember that. I never watched that show either. I was a little too young for that, I think. Other SCX body style, SCX six body style predictions. Um, I would guess a Jeep. I don't know. It's a tough one to make bodies for. That's RC for sure. Oh, Mike J, just checking in. Hi, Mike J, we missed you. Didn't we? Not really. Yes, we did always. <laughs> RC Blokes says, "Hey, Nicole, sell me one of Josh's pro front axles." Okay. <laughs> No problem. The pr problem is you'd have to like actually message me just to. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm not on social media. Jesse, are you going to answer your Instagram tonight? Jesse never answers. Oh, yeah. Phoenix, Musha, Alex, Ben never answers. Ben sometimes answers. Sometimes. Jesse never answers. He has before, actually. Never. Maybe you weren't here. Not me. Not me. That sucks. Aw, my puppies watch Josh on all the live feeds. Stella approves. <laughs> I miss Stella. I you miss all seen, the puppies. Yeah. I haven't seen the kid new kitchen. I haven't seen anything. It's not even new anymore. That's... Frank Sogas has had a big Lita Ford poster over my bed when I was 30, still living at home. I don't know who Lita Ford is. Me neither. She's married to the guitar player from Bon Jovi. Sweet Carol. They called me on my birthday and I answered really drunk. Alex says, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we did. That was funny. That was funny. Musha always sometimes answers. I'm normally putting a kid to sleep at that time. Mm. Oh, Musha, I'm sorry. You too. But, like, I see you more than anyone else. So, like, you're included in that. Okay. I'm usually already sleeping for the after stream party calls. Says who? Ben. Ben. <laughs> Tim, checking in late. Looks like I have missed a lot. You've missed nothing. <laughs> oh our eight month old silver labrador that's a thing i drinks a lot at scale naps yeah it's alabama, it's alabama. Man. <laughs> they have six walmarts and 12 liquor stores actually i think it might be a dry county i think it is a dry county because they had, we couldn't drink at dinner. Maybe Brian, Ryan was with us. Trying to run trailing arms on a crawler, foolish or coolish? Because it's Curly the cat. Foolish or coolish? Um, it's a little bit more difficult to tune a rig for trailing arms, a crawler for trailing arms. Oh, wait. Sorry, if not fun family stuff came up. Happy 51st birthday to me. Whoa. Says Mike J. Everyone, please tell Mike J happy birthday. Even I will say happy birthday. Happy birthday, Mike J. 51. Here's some many more. You know, enough more. We have more Walmarts and liquor stores than that. You're right, but not in Gadsden proper. Gadsden proper? Yeah. <laughs> I don't think there's anything proper. Thank you, Salt Pond. Thank you, Adam. Fun fact that, yes, Arthur, I have been there, and I know that. Where? The Jack Daniels in Lynchburg is... A dry county? Dry county. They can, like, spray it on your hand? They do. Uh, yes. Rod Ullman. Yes, absolutely. No audio, Mike J. Happy birthday. Thank you, everybody. Keep saying it. <laughs> yeah, just for just for a moment, we should just turn off the audio in, in observation of Mike J. Right? I was trying to tell Mike J. Happy birthday, but the sound won't work. You guys are wonderful. I, I love you all. Yeah, sorry you're having a hard time, but your RC family is here for you. Mm -hmm. I can't believe the hotel I reserved is a full smoking hotel. I thought that. <laughs> 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 There's not a difference. <laughs> like, what do you, 
What do you mean, non-smoker? Non like, oh, you must be from California or New York. Let's Blaine see. Sheridan might be related. I'm a Sheridan. Um, but yes, full smoking yuck. Um, good, I'm glad she did. She, this part is funny too. See. That's a beautiful thing about the RRRC family is that everyone's here for everyone. If you're having a hard time, reach out to one of your RRC buddies. And we'll gladly ignore real problems to talk about things that make us happy. Yep. Like, yeah. I've had lots of friends going through like real life hard time but let's stuff. be real if you have are having real problems you can always of course out because but, like for us a lot of times it was just like having going through some real stuff like let's talk about things that aren't that because that's uh that's what i want to do right now voodoo <laughs> trucking that would send him into a real depression what sing happy birthday for him <sighs> not a singer oh yeah not a singer jean-pierre dumore oh i love that name Jean-Pierre. Beautiful. I feel like he's the guy from Tal... Are you the villain from Talladega Nights? Oh, yeah. That's my favorite. Mm, Step Brothers is my favorite, but Tal but Ricky Bobby's my second. Some of my best friends I've never met, says Perry G. <laughs> Anybody with a blue um, wrench next to their name? <laughs> So true. It's lovely though. It's wonderful. Red Rooster AZ says, Josh is like my friend. You got a problem? Let's talk about everything else, but. Yeah. <laughs> like, let's. It's exactly. That's, it's, that is what. Like, that's what we want to do. That's what this is for. Yeah. I'm like. I wouldn't do it if I didn't feel like I, I that had, was like, a thing. Friends going through real. And it was just like, Nicole, be like, how's everything going? Like, oh, I talked to him today. They're like, how's everything going? I'm like, we ain't talking about that. Like, what do you mean? Like His best friend, but like best friend before I met him, like best friend in life. I'm like, oh, I go, and then I, I go see his best friend and I find out so much stuff that I didn't know because that he doesn't talk about. No, it's not, it wasn't the topic. We were talking about trucks. <laughs> no, Cody. Oh, well, Cody and I still talk about trucks. Yeah. Stupid shit. I hope some Phoenix you met new involvement, Josh. Um Curly the Cat, thank you for the five dollars and I love your little avatar. It's adorable. Bet you five dollars you won't sing happy birthday. You lost <laughs> I lost. <laughs> Why is there a crown in the Harley logo? Because uh it is a family thing. Josh's family, the Thedes, which I am now one of. We've all we've ad we adopted a crown, yeah, a, a long, long time ago. My brother drew by hand the one that's in my logo, and then I like drew it digitally and made it my logo in like two thousand. I don't know, eight, nine, eight, seven, maybe. God damn it! Nut needs to go in the hole. The night my ex fiance broke my nose, my buddy and I stayed up all night playing Magic the Gathering and took the is next this day Alex? off work and never talked okay, about it. I was going to say, this sounds exactly like something Alex would say. I don't know if I've ever heard that story. <laughs> JD's RC is, I will not sing to you, but I will tell you happy birthday. <laughs> Be a man. Don't talk about your problems. Make jokes about shit. <laughs> Be a man. Josh is really a king. No. <laughs> Cody says, I'll talk trucks with you. Cody Takas. Hey, Co Cody what? Takas. Taka. Okay, that's Ta not it. Uh, P.S. I drew a second winner for the 50K thing. His name is Cody. He's from Las Vegas. If you're a Cody from Las Vegas, will you check your freaking email, please? I'm trying to give you a truck. Because the one. first guy didn't respond. That. Cody from, and I co don't remember the first guy's name, but if your name's Cody from Vegas, check your email. Come on. 
Um, I'm not going to give away your your email, but it's something. <laughs> All these people are like, I'll be Cody. I'm Cody. Like, come on. <laughs> like, oh, it's almost like I took way too long to give that stupid truck away, and now people have. I'm going to punch you in your face. I know. Hard. Oh, sorry. Chris. Sorry, Cody. Chris. Co sorry, Cody. Chris. Chris. Okay. Chris. All joking aside, Vegas. you're spot on. RC community, Harley Designs and Scale Builders got me through the relentless lockdowns, kept me occupied and entertained. That's why we're here. Yeah. Oh my God. Wait, somebody just mentioned RC Ritter FPV. Uh, no. What? He said, I can make a video ranting Cody from Vegas. Watch us. No, that's not it. Who just said something about Kenny versus Spinney? Twisted Trucker. Ever watch Kenny versus Spinney? Yes. What? What is Kenny versus Spinney? Who's the funny? Is that like the thing where the eye came down and there was that? <laughs> <laughs> it was the funniest fucking show. And it was like a British show or something. And it was so <laughs> funny. And yes. Yes. I watched it and it was hilarious and I loved it. Um, yes. Twisted Trucker. <laughs> yes. I'm right there with you. <laughs> The next time you draw, it must be live and you must be present to win. That, that's not a bad thing. <laughs> we'll have to go there. I mean, seriously. Yes, best show ever. It was so funny. It was literally, it was the funniest fucking show. The They did like an American version on Comedy Central. It was not funny at all. But the Kenny versus Wayne, the, the other one, it was, was Canadian. Okay, there you go. It was hilarious. When me and my first ex broke up, me and my buddy played hooky and went to Sturgis for three days. Love it. It's Canadian. Okay. This motor is not clearing this transfer shaft in the slightest. JD's RC says this past two years have been well spent driving and hanging out with you and many others on YouTube. This is very We're happy. Is that one of Nicole's everything left in the fridge, Bloody Mary's? No, I made that this one. That was last. That was last, last time I was here. Hi, Sukong. What are you doing, girl? Come here. Good girl. Tell me all. Oh, my hippopotamus. She's going to be so mad. I should take her with me. Yeah, she is going to be mad at you. Yeah. And so. Is um, Moose Jaw still in here? Has he been coming? Yes. Moose Jaw, I have a quick project for you. For money. Okay. Everything's funny in Canadian. Are you eating a pickle? Mm-hmm. He said yes. I'm here. Um, I have a, a simple project for you. Mm. Red Rooster has okra in his Bloody Marys. He's not okra. he's from Nebraska. I that's too far north to do okra. I mean true. But my grandpa was from Louisiana. And did we, he do okra? Oh, he did. Yeah. He and chicory and chicory coffee. Do you like me some chicory coffee? Really? It's terrible. I like it. You know where the time machine is? Says Phoenix. <laughs> From idiocracy. Yeah. We're gonna go to Starbucks. <laughs> um, are you making you another one of those? No, I was thinking about grabbing a different motor. Oh no, that's not what I was gonna do at all. The mugs crack me up. We have two that say, sir, if you were my husband, I'd poison your coffee. And madam, if you were my wife, I'd drink it. <laughs> see about a link. Gin or vodka? Uh, he drinks vodka. I drink I, gin. Actually, I'm going to need it longer. We still have not done letter, Kenny. I know we need to do it. Oh, Juan Lacos is my daughter's home from Arizona for the holidays. Congratulations. Yeah, that's fun. Are you guys going to do a live next week since it's Christmas Eve? He probably will. I um, probably will. I will not be here. I will be in Kansas City with the love of my life, my nephew. Besides him, the love of my life is my nephew, who's three. I know, Alex. What's a good comp chassis? Oh, Jake Summers, give Sookie extra pets for me. Our cat passed away Thursday and always would watch the live streams with me and watch the cats when they came on. Sorry, man. Yeah, we know how hard that is. Yep. 
It's the worst. It is the worst. I still have our cat from... Can you say, like, I have our cat from two cats ago? Like, as my screensaver on my phone still? Or is that, like... Insects, Why would you not be able to? I'm just saying, like... Oh, you still like have from two cats ago? Like, oh yeah, that's <laughs> seems fine. like it. A... Oh, you still have my hexum in there. Yeah. Oh my He's baby. Still my background screen on my phone. My baby. Um, peanuts still my background. So. Our current cats are nice and all, but you know they're not. They don't our... make them like they used to. I'm I kidding. mean, <laughs> I'm kidding. They're better than any of them, but still. To be fair, did I say that? To be fair, what? Or did I mean they? We love our cats now, but like the you know when you first like start your life together, and then your first home that you own together, and your first move to fucking California together, and yeah, all they, that. They, it's different. David Ferris will be eating prime rib next Friday, so he will not be here. <laughs> that I don't expect there to be a big crowd on uh, on Christmas Eve, but we'll see. I grabbed a random What is SQ link. bar? What is SQ bar? I don't know what SQ bar is. Wait, why are people asking me what is SQ know. bar? I don't know. What the f*** does that mean? Oh, Red Rooster. Uh, we've got one that's 15. and She's still a mover and a shaker. Yeah, right? she's going to be that 20 plus. Yeah, what, is, what SQ bar? What the f*** does that mean? Cool. When setting up a comp course, is there a minimum and maximum spacing for the gates? Uh, yes. Each class has a minimum. There's only a minimum spacing. Maximum spacing is up to you. Because sometimes maximum spacing can be totally pointless. Um, and it's just all about the yeah, square. I don't, know what the, I don't know what you're talking about. I want to mention my best friend's mom loaned us an eight-week-old tabby. She is hyper running around the house everywhere. <laughs> yeah. Do you still have the tiny wrench holding the little nuts? I do. I can't believe that is an actual thing that you guys know about that I don't. It's right here. It's a tiny wrench. Mm -hmm. Most people have just, so glad someone understands, most people have just tried to give us kittens. Oof. <laughs> Hear nothing better to do, shame Nicole, not on She Make It Good. Uh, since I won't have anything else better, since I won't have anything else to do. Oh. Josh, show Nicole my new cat. Oh, Jesse, I got a new cat. Oh, Je Jesse, that was like two days ago and 500 messages in the mod chat. Where did you get that tiny wrench again? Uh, someone gave it to me like 10 years ago. So I don't know where, but people have told me you can get them at like any auto parts store as like a timing wrench or something like that. It's a 5.5 millimeter. And uh, Gunner says, I'll be here on Friday eating homemade Chio Pino, which I had on my Google what is search. Chio Pino? Uh, it's some sort of soup, I believe. And I had on my Google searches, I'm assuming in Mexico that we ate at a fancy restaurant that had it because I had to Google it and see what it was. <laughs> <laughs> like, I was like, why did you Google it? Because it would have been on the <laughs> menu at a fancy restaurant. <laughs> and I'm like, I don't know what that is. I need to Google it. <sighs> Twisted Trucker says they have tiny wrenches on Amazon, but they do. It's an ignition wrench. Ignition wrench. Will the Vanquish brass ring fit inside the incision wheels? Seafood yes. stew and delicious is Moose Jaw. Yes. See, that was what I thought it was some kind of stew. Some kind of soup. Mm. Chainsaw says I work at Napa tomorrow. I'll see if we have that wrench there. What the? What the? In front of you, Josh. Toolbox. Okay. Everyone knows what it is. I don't know if it's a town. I don't know what it is, but I assumed that it was on the menu and because I just closed out. Yeah. Oh, is that when you were closing out 900 open tabs on your open on your last phone? Is that what you were doing? Yeah. No, but they all transferred over. I only had 40. You had 40 open tabs on your mobile browser? You're yeah. an absolute crazy person. 
You need to just go spend Christmas with Gunner because his mama makes it. Mm -hmm. So is JD's RC. He's making it. What is the truck you're building? Um, plastic links. It's just a... 40. Yes, 40. Yeah. Your uh, RC Ritter FPV says I might have 80 tabs open. What is wrong with you people? You don't need them. If it's been, if it's still open after that time, Alex, get, get is, rid of. Alex is literally having a panic attack right yeah. now. Alex is like the memory. The memory of your phone is going to be. Ex <laughs> is, you're taking so In many front resources. Of you, Josh, from your toolbox, whatever it is. Are you asking about this? This is a link measuring device and it's custom made and it is, it has, you put a link here, you put a rod end on each side and it will tell you the length of the link. It is not a tool you can buy. I mean, I don't know. What? Matthew Romero has more than 40. I hate searching for those pages again. That, well, you're going to search Gunner through the... Gunner is 124. Gunner is... Abs I that, it's have... not true. That's not even possible. Yeah. Oh, Your phone... that it won't, it won't do that. Yeah, it will. It won't. My iPad does. When you always complain to me about... You're like, I need a new iPad. Just close the tabs. It'll be like brand new again. MX3304. I don't... I don't use Chrome, first of all. And second of all, it's not on a computer. It's on my phone. Nicole won't go on a computer for some reason. Like, nah. I'm like, go on my PC. She's like, nah. I went on. I got on it today. You got on my computer today? I had to renew my cosmetology license. And then, and me and Jamie, I do my, I do the cosmetology license. Don't, you don't admit to fraud on live videos. Oh. But we got the same. Bitch still hasn't been mowed me your money yet either. What mm. chassis is that? This is a scattergun chassis. It is linked in the description below. What axles? Stock AR44. I took a bone stock honcho and I'm doing this swap. But we're getting some link interference issues here. Ian says, what are taps on phone? Like the different windows open. Like when you go to your internet browser and you hit new tab. And... Gunner sent a screenshot. Did you really? You did. Let's see. Oh my God. Let me see. 124 tabs. Yes. Let's see what some of these are. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't think about that, did you? When you sent it. You South didn't. Park Halloween something. <laughs> I paid for those resources, resources and I use that for Cheap, tabs. Cheapioni, but he he spelled it wrong and it said, did you mean? But like a long ways wrong. <laughs> Let's see. E-flight manual for the planes that he and I are going to crash together. Um, Hangar 9 carbon cup. I feel like you're a bad influence, Gunner. <laughs> Pornhub, Razor, <laughs> <laughs> Does it look like I know what a JPEG is? Does it look like I just wanted a picture of a goddamn hot dog? <laughs> my son has 155 open tabs on Oh phone. my god. I would never share my web browser, says Alex. That's begging for trouble. <laughs> What is it with pan hard link issues with AR44 and flat rail chassis? Just a, pan hards are a geometry nightmare. But the problem is that this one's titanium. A geometry nightmare. Old geometry is a nightmare, if you ask me. Geometry is amazing. I hate all of you double digit or triple digit pad people. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody needs to share browsers. Screw sharing privacy, people. I don't know what that means. Um, how do you like your Wraith 1.9, Josh? I like it. This is going to be interesting. So can we talk about how I made a letter to Santa tonight? Or today? Do you need help? <clears throat> Did you poop yourself? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, if you guys, bad. if you ever need to make Josh laugh, just ask him if he pooped himself because he's so modest that he will never, like Josh has never farted in front of me. 
ever. Like, I'm not, people are going to be like, are you joking? I'm not joking. I'm literally not joking. Like, he would wake up before he farted in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> Never. Um, <laughs> like, he's turning red now because of that. But, like, never. Um, <laughs> so cute. Josh is just weird. trying to yeah. bend a damn titanium lake. <laughs> I don't even remember where I was going. I don't either. <laughs> Josh, you Dutch. No. No. It's so weird. It's so weird. I'm like, are you human? I'm like, he holds in his sneezes. I'm like, you're going to shit out your intestines if you keep doing that. Like, holding in your sneezes. Um. Uh, yeah, Josh is a closet farter. I pretty much crap myself in front of my wife. Farts are funny. I, I did not, Frank, but I would have told you if I did. That's how you blow an O-ring. Thank you, Adam. <laughs> when you get old, never trust a fart. What shock link players are you using, Josh? I'm using some very old hot racing ones. I've had them for like 10 years Boom, or Nicole more. gets pink eye next week. So it's just, <laughs> when I was dating my wife, I wouldn't drop a deuce at her house for the first three months. I hold it and go to the corner store. <laughs> oh, he still does that after 10 years. It's okay to rip ass. It's human. A proper bed rumble. A proper bed rumble is how you say I love you. <laughs> oh, man. I was crop dusting like crazy at work today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Josh pull my finger at nationals. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> uh, that dumb guy says, I, Josh, I hold my sneezes as well. You're not alone. You're going to shit out your intestines one day because I, there's nothing. It's not safe. It's not healthy to hold in your, your sneezes. You don't think? No. I don't think. Now that. we know the true origin of the Ripper name. <laughs> You've reached the stage of your relationship yet where he will Dutch oven you. You have something to look forward to, I guess. <clears throat> I didn't fart in front of my ex-fiancé for four months until she let out a huge fart. Feed him a bowl of... No. No, like, never. Yeah, come out your ears. Thank you. That was what I tell him. <laughs> He's going to blow up holding in all those farts and sneezes. Thank you. That's what I say. <laughs> Cody says it's okay to rip ass. That's what I say, too. <laughs> I bet Nicole farts in front of Josh. I mean, I do. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> but like, I'm a human. It's human. <laughs> Never shit myself, but I have a ruptured eardrum because of it. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> Frank Outdoors, thank you for the $5. You're going to love that Chelsea. I have two of them. <laughs> We're having different conversations. <laughs> totally different. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm, you know. Fart, be a man. <laughs> it explains why he's always full of shit. <laughs> yeah. My brother-in-law drove an hour to see my sister before they got married. She accidentally farted while sitting in his lap like five minutes after he got there and she made him go home. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys. <laughs> Steve from Australia here. Could you do a head-to-head -head with this truck and another stock 10-2 honcho so we... Can see the improvement difference pretty please. Voodoo trucking says let her rip. Oh. I don't do a lot of the whole I threw a screw somehow. No. I don't do a whole lot of the head to heads because you can't do them like soup. I don't know. I mean I don't know. I don't know. The consensus is okay. I have to push my hernia back in after I Jesus Christ, people. How broken are you? Dutch ovens are part of being in love. That's kind of what I think. That was your chance, Josh. You're just silly. I don't know what is binding here. I don't even talk about it. Oh, it's that shock. You will not talk about it. 
so silly. He's such a prude. What's wrong with you people? You're savages, is what you all are. Just humans. Savages. I'm civilized. I'm sophisticated as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to... It's like bleeding shocks. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't there estrogens on that freaking tear tonight? I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a, oh my god, Alex. I'm a savage. Classic, <laughs> bougie, <laughs> ratchet. <laughs> Do it in the Jeep. If... If uh, Alex, if you can do the dance, uh, I'll do it. I'm broken, but at least I can get it right. <laughs> that should be a vanquished shirt for sophisticated as fuck. I can't even say it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm broken, but at least I can fart, says Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> the phrase is fancy as fuck, get it right. <laughs> so we are normal. Still trying to figure you out, Josh. Thank you. <laughs> I shut down a kid in the Donald's birthday party all near the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> when I left, the whole party was standing up front with the manager asked for a party refund. <laughs> <laughs> he was, he's never commented before. <laughs> Just so you know. Uh. <laughs> 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 just so you know, he's that's the first time he's ever commented, and it was for that. Just because. <laughs> How old was the kid? Like, this is like a sixth birthday party, or was it like a <laughs> first held at the McDonald's? <laughs> Daddy Woo Woo, thank you so much for the $20. That's so kind. LOL, y'all funny ASF. <laughs> Love your streams. Got a race oval tomorrow, so checking out. Enjoy. Oh, change my name from Woo Woo's Reefs, LOL, to my nickname, Daddy Woo Woo. Okay. Thanks, sir. Thank you. Oh, my God. <sighs> I saved mine up for bed. F those kids. Fart talk has <laughs> yeah. me crying. Dumb and dumber should have seen. Everyone is crying laughing. <laughs> this thing does still not want to flex <gasps> this direction. What'd you do? Oh, I thought I ordered sushi. Why are you acting like you were going to be like? Because I didn't know. Oh, now it's that screw hitting the freaking shock collar at the bottom. <laughs> I wish this pan hard was like maybe two or three millimeters more forward. Like the actual mount. Okay, how to fix that? We are going to... It's okay, Josh. It's okay to be classy, says Phoenix. It's okay to be classy. <laughs> My J, what the fuck did I log back and do? <laughs> I hope that you have been watching and listening to all of us talk about how much we love you and all of that. God damn it, Josh. What? I need to order. I, don't, I want fucking food. Well, I farted while going into Walmart. When I had to apologize to the guy behind her. <laughs> Can you show us the problem, John? Uh, Might need to add a spacer between the frame and shocks. Friday night fart talk live. Josh is dying. There we go. I got it. I had to leave it from phone to tablet. I. Uh, Maybe I can lean it a little. So this pan hard mount here on uh, right here, this one, when it was coming down, it was hitting the lower shock cut or spring cup here at the bottom of the shock and it was stopping the travel. So I just <sighs> laid it way back to try and get all my travel back. I can and build this but better. It did it. Cool. So. Are you almost done? <sighs> I don't know. I don't I don't know anything anymore. Just, You're so ridiculous. Like, relax, Josh. You people are broken. Relax. Um, I don't know what that says, but Opa, Brazil, 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 Manda, Salve. There's a couple Hampton Inns, a Best Western Holiday Inn, Express Comfort Inn, Fairfield Inn, and Sweet. I love that song. 
Uh, I think he was talking about Alabama. I, I'm kidding. Because he's from Alabama. I'm kidding. I was talking about a song done by a popular rapper and, uh, oh. where he listed hotels, motels, that is like, and holiday inns. That's from like when I was like 15. I'm, it will. Uh, I woke myself up in the middle of the night because I was farming most foul in my sleep. <laughs> You're a classy bitch, Josh. Own it. <laughs> farting, not farming. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Front shocks had to get laid way down, but we haven't fixed the motor issue. <clears throat> it's okay. It's going to have to get there. Let's get the servo dropped in. Keep talking, reading my shit. Read it, read it, okay, read it. Okay, let's see. It. Relax, Josh. Just let it off. No. Yeah. Did you say no? You're a psycho. Yeah, huh? Uh huh? You're gonna. That. No. I'm... Bad for you. It's bad for me? Yeah. Huh? It is. Bad for you. Whoops. So I'm going to get the stock servo put in and then we'll start taking a look at bumpers and body plates. Now. Is there a purpose for the truck? No, just putting it together. Is there a purpose for any of this shit? <laughs> Some of them have purpose. What? What? Um, no. That one I bought on an airplane and that's the first truck I bought on an airplane. Um, Gosh. that one, what? So you, what you're telling me you paid for internet and a truck? I think I'm still, airplane? no, I'm still on the ground. Okay. I was just in an airplane. Good. It's not the only thing I bought in an airplane, but it's the only, ow. Dumbass. I bought, remember I bought all that brass on the plane that one time and you were like, really? You think I remember that? Well, I just remember you saw my aiming cart. While I was checking out. Oh yeah, I don't remember that. You're like, what are you doing? Alex, you need to relax. What did Alex say? Nothing. Good. Nothing. <laughs> three three rolls. That's fine. Oh my goodness. Sushi is so expensive. Everything's expensive. I know. Nope, that was not on the deep. I didn't, I would never have paid. Paid for what? For internet on my deportation flight. You wouldn't have? No. Not if it was. I would not pay for internet on a flight, period, end of story. I mean, I do most of the time. No, you don't. <laughs> not when you're with me. You thought. I know. I do it just so I can get notifications. Oh, I'd be so pissed at you, and you don't. <laughs> so don't don't act like you're fucking falling because <laughs> you're not. Um. Hey, prime time. Kick back, watching Josh have a gas of a ton. Scott Allen says I'm deaf. Dude, I don't think I have live captions on. I would, but it has it causes issues with. Yes, the... I did get a new phone. Yeah, Nicole. Yeah. The guy at the AT&T store said, what phone is that? What I had. I was like, I don't know. Something with a button. Something with a button. Some iPhone with a button. I yeah. was like, the fuck do you care? Did not. Good thing Nicole did not see your pile from Wednesday. It wasn't that bad. It's been way worse. WTF are we building tonight? Nicole slash Josh. I know. <laughs> this is a stock SC Extend 3. He bought all the class SCX1 T. tires he could find. Do the people not send you tires? I don't accept. Why would you buy all of them? I don't accept tire sponsors because then you get locked in. So I've never. So you buy all of them? That's the dumbest shit I've ever heard. Why would you buy all of them at once? Why wouldn't you just buy the ones I don't that know you which need? Ones, I don't know which one's going to be best. And I haven't tried them. I'm sorry. Is this not your job? Not all. Well, is I, this not what you do mm. for a living? You don't know which ones are best? Not in that size. Josh. Oh, my God. 
Oh my God. Oh my God. It was like three or four different types is all. <laughs> you can't know everything unless you try them. It wasn't even that many. It was all of them that they had in stock. Not like all of them. <sighs> like there was way more. Wait, my wife on the screen is probably scared. Okay. Joe, you can come over and take some fucking tires from this asshole. <laughs> I have them. Oh I started getting my project boxes done. Like I have a class one box. We'll see us got a little tire. Oh, don't even start with me about you saying your. My organizational skills. Don't talk about getting your projects done. I will start throwing these cars onto this desk so fast. Like, go. Watch out, that one's heavy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. How many or not? No, don't start. Don't start with me. I've been very productive. Oh shit, Josh, def quick, defuse the situation. Now's the time to fart. <laughs> <laughs> Jesse says, oh, wait, Joe, grab some for me, too. <laughs> if Josh farts around me, it's no big deal. But if he buys for me tires, I'll kill him. <laughs> it's true. Mm -hmm. Hey, Josh, I just bought my first cell phone. twenty four ninety five. Outrageous. Wife is happy. I'm not. What? Says Brian. Brian. Oh, Brian Sherwood? Yeah. <laughs> now you can take a photo. I'm just upset that Brian doesn't wear a captain's hat when he drives his... When he's captaining? Yeah. I'm... This does seem like a missed opportunity. It does. And I, we... I act like we did not Facebook stalk Brian <laughs> Sherwood. He and sent me the thing. If he does not wear a captain's hat. He sent me the list and I was like, yeah, see? And we were really upset by it. So I need to find a cap. If I ever find a cap inside an estate sale, which I love estate sales, just FYI, um, I'm going to get it and mail it to Brian Sherwood, so he can wear a captain's hat. Does Josh realize he is depriving deaf and blind people by not farting? What the? Earl Martin says hi. You walked into a hell of a stream shirt. A car, you just pick one off the shelf, Eric says. Don't tempt me with a good time, Eric Baker. Because I. That's what she said on my first date. Hi. No. No. You were not nearly that fun. <laughs> Was I not? You were. Brian says, I'll bring my boat hat to Nationals, but no, I. What's a boat hat? I need it to be a captain's hat. Yeah, it's like. Like, if you have a 1920s, like, wood boat, you need to have a 1920s, like, captain's hat like my great grandma's boyfriend the captain yeah but he didn't have a boat no but he but had he, a van yeah he had a van but he was and a, a wife and a wife it was his grandma it was her grandma's boyfriend from yeah that's how you live to be 108 people yeah <laughs> date married guys <laughs> <laughs> Harold Wright says he only bought the 22 sets we had. I feel like Harold Wright works for whatever the tire company is. And I'm going to need you to send me your phone number. <laughs> you know they won't block accounts for you, right? I bet that they would block I bet you they won't. For me. I bet they would. Uh, Pitbull won't, but Proline will. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Mike have too much dirt on each other. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's why Pitbull won't. <laughs> Be like, I won't say anything if you don't. Yeah. Um, deal. <laughs> now, now, where did we park? That's why we don't go to St. Louis, people. Yeah. Because of Mike from Pitbull. <laughs> How did drummer insist on wearing a captain's hat on stage? Had. Um, why would you not want, like, I'm sorry, but a captain's hat is always in style. Uh, captain Jim. Noted. Noted. 
He lived to 108. Like, she knows something. We have lost so many viewers. Yeah. <laughs> Red Rooster is, yeah, I love the show. Josh shows me how to build Narcy and Nicole shows me what not to say to my wife. <laughs> you are correct. <laughs> right. Buying RC cars all the time is a hobby, but I buy some Coke twice in a week and all of a sudden everyone's freaking out. I I buy some what? Nothing. Coca-Cola. Uh -oh. One guy gets a hat, captain's hat on stage and that's David Lee Roth. Um, Alex, you don't even know who David Lee Roth is. You're not old enough. Let's see. It doesn't look terrible. I mean, that's that tan is hideous. Yeah, sure, it doesn't look terrible. Will the flip kit still work with this chassis? No, I don't think so. I think it, that flip kit was pretty specific. I mean, maybe if you did it and then what's a flip kit? There was one that you could like put on the back and it would flip the body up like this. Alex is thirty-two. He's older than me, so. What? Ow. My stepbrother was considering a honcho, but got a deadbolt. Why same, same, same. They're both. How do y'all keep drinking without peeing? I don't know. <laughs> I was just thinking about that, actually. I think I should pee, but I'm good. My great grandma lived to be 109, so she got to be that old from eating so many pickles and it pickled her. My grandma got to be 108 by being, by holding on to her grudges and being hateful. There is that. Yeah. And line dancing. And line dancing. Yeah. Line dancing and, and holding on and being hateful. That keeps you alive. Nicole's robbing the grave. I am. All that body needs is two bang bangs in the back winder like my honcho. Right. Are we done? Um, no. I always like to hold a grudge. Well, you're going to live forever. Um, start line dancing, Swoof, and you're good. Line dancing and being hateful. That's what keeps you young. <laughs> That'll do it. Yep. Let's... I need to pee. Can we pause? Sure. Hey, all guys. Catching up from Argentina. Why are you? Not building an orange plane, says Max M. I was worried that people wouldn't watch me build a plane. I wouldn't. Where's the bomber interior? Uh, <laughs> Rock and City said next week. Yeah. Son of a biscuit. Gatorade bottle. Hey, yeah, I'm hooked up underneath the desk. Me too. Too mean to die. Yeah, that is an understatement. Everyone knows that that's the truth. Who knew her? So, first tip to building class one. Um, I don't know about line dancing. I prefer lane filtering on two wheels on LA freeways. Well, then you're going to die. <laughs> Easy. And it just starts snowing, says Adam. He's in Iowa. N North Dakota? South Dakota? Oh, that was close. Same thing. Alex says, in all fairness, I'm not watching you build a truck either. I'm here for Nicole. <laughs> <laughs> Allowable. Plain build would have been a great comedy night. Happy Festivus, y'all. It's a Festivus miracle. Do we know what, what Festivus is? No, I do not. I just know it from it's Seinfeld. friends. Didn't you're, Phoebe say it? Are not. you playing a game? What? You're addicted to gin rummy. Like a 96-year-old woman. I do love some Jim Remy. God. <laughs> Mr. 1998 Deep Cherokee, first tip for building a class one. Buy all a different class one tire, different tires they make for class one. That's a good start. Festivus is a holiday for the rest of us. Seinfeld, not friends. Yeah, that's what I said, Seinfeld. Yeah, Festivus for the rest of us. But isn't it, it's that's a Seinfeld. Festivus miracle. Isn't that, Phoebe? Seinfeld. Are you sure? Yeah. You're a fucking loser. I think you're wrong. I think you're bullshitting. Um, video is not here, so no memes. Thank God. That bothers... 
I told Josh the other day when he was filming the news. Um, and I said, he yelled at me about something and I told him to eat shit. And fuck off. And fuck off. And I. And it was on film. And I said, if you use that at the end of your video, I will fucking divorce you. <laughs> it was because one of the cats puked, like, okay. And she's like walking by the door, like exclaiming. I'm like, and while I'm filming, I'm like, what? I'm like, seriously? And then she walks in and tells me to fuck off. And eat shit. Yeah. I'm like, she's like, I was like, yeah, seriously. You don't get to yell at me from in here when I'm cleaning up. I've stuck my hand in cat vomit, in hot cat vomit. And you don't get to talk to me about not saying things out loud. Like, you can Like, just... I walk around talking to these cats all day long. I'm sorry that I don't change my habits when you. Because... You can do it just quieter. Like, while I'm filming. I'm sorry. You don't have your live on air sign lit up outside. You want me to do that? Yeah. Like I inside do. the door? Yeah, absolutely. Do that and you'll never have another, uh, never have another loud comment again. During filming? Sure. Done. Do it. I actually saw a cool one that you can buy. Your mom bought you a cool one. I'll put that one in here. I have one that I can go out there and I can just do it from an app <laughs> on it. And I can make it say different things. Do it. Fucking do it. I'll just say like, shh. Yeah, do that. Do that. And I was I'm like, I'm just gonna put it above the TV. No, when I said that, and I then at the end of me yelling at him, I said, if I see if that goes on the end of it, like an outtakes on your scale news update, I'm going to divorce you. <laughs> is what I said, and I assuming it didn't. I don't know. You think you're right? I I mean I would have to. Everyone's saying, but warm cat vomit. Like, so I assume they didn't see that. I called BS on that. No, that really happened. I did stick my finger in hot cat vomit. <laughs> About 86. Oh my God, this show is wild. <laughs> <laughs> Rockin' said he stood up for you. So they're your friend. Said it didn't end up on the end of scale news. Thank you. And it's not because if it would have been really like... If the audio would have been good and all that, like it might have, but. <laughs> if you divorce him, you won't be on Friday Night Lives. Don't tempt me. <laughs> Do not tempt me. Emmons Racing, thank you for the $5. My favorite is stepping into a hairball with my toes in the dark. Good times. Yeah, I don't. I a don't. sign will not stop you from speaking your mind, young lady, says Phoenix. <laughs> she can still speak and it. Jesse just... says, Alex, who are you going to live with, Josh or Nicole? <laughs> <laughs> that dumb guy says, remember, Josh, she pulls a knife, gets some bread, and her womanly instincts will kick in. She'll make you a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> we went too no tall. one's fighting no this is not fighting no one's fighting I don't think we've ever had a fight I mean like ever ever sure when I don't know yeah like Mike J says what was that noise Josh I wish. Josh, Phoebe didn't mention Festivus, but she did create Christmas Eve Eve. Yay, two Christmases. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, Alex is Jewish. I don't really can't. So. Man, Midwest people are loud. You have no idea. I'm not even kind of. <laughs> Do you need one of the Scalar Fab pre-runner bumpers for this build? Thanks to you, I have a few on the shelf. <laughs> I don't know what I'll use yet. Would well, Josh bought that thing? You didn't know about it yet. <laughs> My Ender 3 V2's Z axis stopper sensor is misaligned. I've been working on it. Oh, where did it go? Working on bed leveling for a couple of days. Solutions. The, the, that's a, a tough one to not without seeing. I, I, I don't know that I'm going to be help to you on that one without 
being able to like see the truck or see the printer. That was your other wife, Josh, that you fought with. Oh. Hey, Nicole, when my wife threatens to leave, I tell her no problem, but I'm coming with you. <laughs> that, okay, that would solve... I'm sorry, Frank. That is a great comeback. That would solve any problem because I'd be like, oh, you actually mm. care. <laughs> like, that would solve any problem ever. Josh, I love the fact that you're desperately trying to hold your ground against someone literally wearing a shut the fuck up shirt. <laughs> <laughs> um let's see now they're having inside conversations this is about where alex is gonna live alex is living it with me i need someone who can do computers <laughs> <laughs> he's just gonna open your phone every day and close the tabs like, fixed <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine me trying to move into a, a, a uh, what does he have, a storage container, or uh, what do they call it? What's it called? Are you thinking of, a sh like, a shipping container? That's what he lives in. A Is tiny that house. true? Yes. He lives in a shipping container. Can you imagine me trying to move into a shipping container? It would just be covered. <laughs> like, you're like, I don't have that much stuff, but you do, and it's everywhere. Yeah. It's just like. A tiny house, Yeah. Josh, would you, Josh would go with you because he doesn't know how to pack or cook. Ian, you're correct. You underestimate All, my, my. Perfect. Uh, Phoenix says he'll just move out on his own and visit both of us for his holidays. <laughs> I have a room, singular. My bathroom is also a shower. <laughs> Jeff, come on over. Thank you. Hey, Josh, let us know if the live on air brings peace and quiet in the house. If it does, I will have to get one for sure. <laughs> Did you see that? Like, I will have to get one for sure. <laughs> wow, way to make Alex sound like he's, he's not homeless at all, but he lives in a shipping container. It's super awesome. Yeah, you said I mean, like, I don't want to live in Minnesota. You but said storage container. And that's shipping what I container. <laughs> <laughs> How come that doesn't surprise me, Alex? Small car, small house. Josh doesn't have much stuff, but his countless RC products spread between four locations. Thank you, Paul's one eight one six. Oh, I, I'm not saying I don't have much stuff. Like, I mean, I really don't have much stuff, but like, I just need a few thousand square feet for storage of things. I mean, less if I can stack it higher, but <sighs> it's like, you yeah, know. It's just Josh and his pop-up camper, and no. Josh will move to Nova Scotia, and YouTube channel goes to crap. <laughs> Heading to us, we have 10 to 15 minutes. Ten, that's how long you have for food? Yeah. All right. Nicole can't have much stuff because of all the, ho the houses full of RCs. You're... I would love, I would love to say that that is the reason our house is full of things. Uh, I had a girl over once and she was very confused with why there was a shower head in the middle of my bathroom. Never been in a trailer? <laughs> like, you mean like, a, you're talking a travel trailer, right? Well, yeah. I mean. I need more body posts. I know where to go. You have holes in your pants. I know. These are my... Not these are my don't leave the house leggings. Shut up. <laughs> Why would you say that out loud? Like every can every travel trailer has not the Ramaza Inn. Has a shower in the bathroom, right? No. Well I mean your parents doesn't, but it's fancy. Yeah, it's just like how Crocs have holes in them. Let's breathe on the knees. Because my knees get cold or warm, hot. We can all move to the cave and be sent to our rooms. Oh, I, I was. Phoenix has a big house. We can. Just we were talking because there's a cave for sale in Missouri. Which one? It's near Carthage. And I told precious them. Precious Moments I told, Chapel. I said it's right near the Precious Moments Chapel. 
but it's 25 acres of cave space on 30 some acres of land. And it's 160 grand. Yes, please. We cannot afford a house in California, but we will buy 25 acres worth of fucking cave in Missouri. Yeah. <laughs> like. Hey, Joshua, maybe you can cut slots for the frame rails in the bed. No stink bugs. Oh, my trailer has a separate shower. I'm all fancy. We're going to have to look at Well, the front of the body needs to go up, so it should sit about there. Either way, I'm going to have to trim the yeah, fenders. Yeah, no, swoof. It is exactly like what you just said, like a pair of long johns. Don't leave the house leggings. Sound like a pair of long johns with holes. It's exactly. Um, I really wanted to buy the bank in Tightwad, Missouri. Yes, there was a bank for sale in Tightwad. To turn into an Airbnb. This body's sitting way too high, though. We are going to have to cut the bed. Sucks for you. Um, but yeah, I, I did want to do that. Um, and no one took me up on that offer. I did not have any investors. Jake's company got their Series A funding today. I don't know what that means. The venture capitalist company got bought in for Series A funding. There you go. Alex can just move this container to the corner of the cave. That's fine. I'm fine with that. I'm good with that. The rest of us are going to have to buy regular travel trailers. Mike Jake. Yeah. I did say Tightwad. There's yeah. The, it's, the town is called Tightwad, just like you spelled it. Yeah. And it has a population of 69. It does. And there, the bank in Tightwad, population 69. Went out of business. Was for sale. Your favorite horologist checking in for the first time hey. in a long time. It is a long time. And we would like more pictures of your kitty. Any chair recommendations for the workbench? Ooh. Don't even. I can't. You don't want my. Ch you don't want my. No, thoughts. because your other chair. I do need. A, I do need a new chair. A second chair. Black shit all over my floor. We got some cutting. Christine up says. Here. Your looks good tonight. You need to come visit. We would love to come visit. I really want to see your new kitchen, Tony. Gonna have to cut those bars under the bed. Yep. Hi, Christine. I love Christine. We're also gonna have to just remove the whole insert for now. Hi, hey. Chief. Wow, that was a lot. Come here, baby. Hello. Come on. Um, I would recommend the secret lab chair. David Ferris says. Oh, secret. I've seen those. I have not. It. One weird cheap chairs. Oh, my baby. Oh, my big boy. Arthur says, I love my secret lab, Titan. I've seen that. I have not uh, not looked into bond. I like the uh, mesh, the full mesh back, full mesh bottom chairs. Because you're sweaty. Because I don't want, because if you sit in a chair for like three hours straight or during live streams, things can get warm. Hi, Bubba. Oh, our DoorDash is approaching. Hi. You good boy. Get you a Tempur Pedic chair. I feel like that would get too hot. What's up, buddy? What are you doing? Being cute and sweet and perfect. I love you. Just got a new phone and AirPod Pro is pretty cool. Yeah, for sure, Tony. But I won't be back until after the new year. Please throw up again, Kitty. <laughs> it wasn't him. It was, Are you sure? It was Sookie. Yeah, really? I watched. And then you still stuck your hand in it? Not on purpose. Forty-two acres of the cave for sale, Theodosa, Missouri. Ooh, another one. I don't know where that one is. Ozark that County. Oh, that's way south. Is it? No. I believe. Pretty sure. No, we're not watching. Little Nicky was a terrible Adam Sandler movie. Oh, yeah. Remember that good Adam Sandler movie? Nope. What? Happy Gilmore. Only good one. And then he made trash. So it's growing at my baby. <laughs> uh, they... 
Tony was saying that they're they'll tell the dogs to get the kitty in the backyard, <gasps> even if there's not, or if there was a straight yeah, cat. Obviously. Uh but evidently they said that the other night and then Stella went and did it, but it wasn't a kitty, it was a skunk. <laughs> oh, did you have to give her a bath in tomato? <laughs> no, it's something else, but it was <laughs> got a skunk bath. <laughs> All right. I mean, old honky reviews in RC channel. I do like the Bob Barker, but the price is wrong, bitch. bitch. <laughs> Every time I go mini golfing, I look for like the the like indents that they had in Happy Gilmore. The indents. Yeah, you can like see the indents that they have for the ball to go into the hole. Does that ever worked? We just went mini golfing a few and weeks you ago. Sucked. I did. I lost by one stroke. I know, but you sucked bad. And not to you. Oh, you did way here. Whoa! I was not that bad at all. Your food has dropped off. You gonna go get it? Yeah. Thank you. You can chat with your dasher up to thirty minutes. After your order is complete. Why would you want to do that? I have no idea. Did you get a like, did you eat one of my fries? You did a good job. Nah. Uh, I'm just pulling this, uh, pulling this rear bed piece apart so that we can Yeah. Am I done? Sure. Just put it in the fridge for a little bit. We won't be long. I'm just doing. I'm not gonna have it mounted like that, but I'm just putting it under there so I can get an idea of ride height, because that's probably a little bit more reasonable. Puts the wheel wells about where they should be. We'll cut it a little bit just so that it gets better clearance, but. Crawler Baller, thank you for the $5. Are you guys into short-term rentals? I have about 20 listings. Bank, b and in Taiwan. Bank sure. Let's come. Am I, I does this have a GoPro mount on his drill? No, that's a... That's like a bit holder and that comes on the drill. It's a, it's got like three, two <laughs> bits. Like a GoPro. But it's, it's for the drill. No, I did. I did have a bank in Taiwan that I, Missouri, that I wanted to turn into an Airbnb. And yes, we would like a short term rental in Taiwan at some point. Hi, Bubby. Thank you. Did anything? Yes, it did a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm just going to mock this up for now. That one, Missouri. That one. <laughs> Yeah, we would love to go to Taiwan. Yeah. Do you use element axles for any LCG builds? Do I use what? Element axles? Um, I haven't, no. Crystal Cave, 71 acres in Springfield, Missouri, known as one of the most beautiful caves in its original and natural state. The caves and gift shop could be reopened for tours. 1.2 million. <laughs> Ryan, can we have a loan? <laughs> Are you... Oh, I was like, wow, where did, wow, that was rude. Get your own. <laughs> Josh, I know why the paint on the Flex Seal truck is how it is because I did the same thing on the Phoenix. What? How? Please explain. 
Ooh, Lad Ridge RC, awesome. I'm looking for a cave to build a compound on, not for Sherry. <laughs> not for Sherry. <laughs> so we were talking about the other day, Jesse was, when we were talking about the cave, Jesse was like, yeah, we put like a house on the outside so like when people came and visit. And I said, and I said, Jesse's out. He's trying to invite people. Oh, yeah. No, we don't do people. Like, mm, no people. No. If he sounds like a really good idea, like, no, no people. No. I mean, if you tell people, then my family would be there. And, then it and would that's just, a lot. Like, how many, how much did you say? 42 acres? Full. Yeah. <laughs> it would be full. We'd be like, oh, free land? Done. We'll bring our trailers. We're good. <laughs> Sprayed silver when the black was still wet and it bled through. Never would have expected it. Hmm. Learn something every day. Everybody. Oh. So let's figure out a bumper still, but move it back to about there. Right there. Hi, buddy. That's a good boy. Mm-hmm. You're gonna miss my bubby. Gonna miss my bubby. All right. Let's eat sushi. Smaller mods and eat sushi. So that is all for Friday night. It's all you get. So um, yeah. I hope you all have a good week in advance of christmas merry christmas i won't see you i'm gonna sneeze <sighs> yes uh N merry christmas from nicole because she is uh out of here she's out tomorrow like we all need to leave here at like 10 30 i got a pack still oh yeah and it's holiday trap well it shouldn't be too bad flying should be easy yeah, it'd be easy. Sure. So. Merry right. Christmas. Merry Christmas. I'll probably see you before then. I may even do <laughs> Sunday. I don't know what that meant either. But that was weird. Yeah, it was. It was spam. Yeah. Um, yeah. Why isn't this going again? This is running. It's ready to go. It's done, actually. Other than a bumper, it's ready to go. Maybe not. But that's all. Thanks again for watching. Um, oh, I did have this open. Let's thank a bunch of people real quick. Squint Balador, Scott O'Blander, Gunnar Nissen, Nicholas Goslin, Mark Cargill, Eric Baker, RC Patini Guy, Sean S. Dale C., Brian Sherwood, Rob Montana, Jeremiah Salberg, Old Time RC, Jimmy Two Horses, Crawler Baller, uh, Curly the Cat, Frank Outdoors, Daddy Woo Woo, Emmons Racing, Crawler Baller. And I don't know why it won't let me scroll any further down, but I think that was the last one, right? I don't know. I don't know either. That's Merry very... Christmas. Merry Christmas. And uh, yeah, we'll see you soon. Goodbye. Now I said.